in 40K, hundreds of events, and constant updates. Skip the learning curve of Warhammer and join the pros. Art of War is led by multiple world champions with decades of success. We teach clinics, stream games, and inspire you to succeed at your favorite hobby. Join our global community of gamers just like you. exciting YouTube game. I'm here with the one, the only, the master of chaos, Mark Perry. I'm here with the jank and the tank. Well, no tank top. I need no, to get no, tank no top. tanks. Only jank in this one. So we are Flip bringing jank. you our, is this our first game with Chaos Space Prince? This is our first YouTube game with Chaos Space Prince mm -hmm. coming out, bringing out a total of 36 noise marines. 36 noise marines. Right, the 40. Hmm, spicy indeed. So we are bringing out an absolutely classic matchup. We are doing Space Marines against Chaos Space Marines. Ultramarines versus Emperor's Children. The Primarch Gulliman is on the table. He's already dead. He's heard that these Marines have two wounds now, and he's like, all right, well, I, I've got three damage. So we're going to make this one work. So I'm really, really excited about this game. I'm bringing out Ultramarines, pure Ultramarines, not even successors, because you know what? They did get a little bit cheaper. Yeah. They got a little bit better. War Vets. No, the Tyrannic War Vets. <laughs> Cheaper um, than Tacticals and better in every way. Yeah, they, they didn't even go down. They're just the same. But Goldman <laughs> went down 80. <laughs> Goldman went down 80 points, so he gets That's to be huge. on the table for this yeah. one. Uh, Cheaper Goldman is exactly what I wanted to see because I did not want to pay Nightbringer prices oh. for, the, for this guy. <laughs> so here we are. We're going to Ultramarines against your Emperor's Children. This yep. is your uh, first stream game with uh, the, uh, the Codex. Codex. Chaos Space Marine Codex. Oh. We're going to be playing mission number 12, Tear Down Their Icons. I do that definitely and uh we're gonna be using wtc style terrain for this one yep so wtc style it's in the season we got a couple mm -hmm. months for all the european players and if any of the american players are interested it's good for practice and get universal things check it out guys absolutely and like while we're talking about terrain Ooh. let's actually mention one of our wonderful sponsors big bear 3d big bear 3d is a wonderful stick. terrain uh, <laughs> sponsor they put out um 3d printed uh t warhammer terrain as well as like cosplay uh props yep. and more you can actually go on their website right now, BigBear3D.net, and check out the latest table that they just put out. It is actually the Jack Harpster table uh, in collaboration with Way Games. Big Bear has made this. It's a fully like uh, modular uh, 40K table, the first one that they've done. So you can build a ton of different combination of ruins. You can use clips that are 3D printed as well to assemble and uh, take apart the terrain. So yep. absolutely fantastic. Check out BigBear3D.net. Find out more information there. Click. Ultramarines, Emperor's Children. Ultra -pro. You excited for this? You want to, you want to talk so about excited. your list? So the list has gone after a couple of variations. This is not quite up the most updated one, but when you know putting some list down, this is what I had in my mind, mm -hmm. and I'm just toying with it constantly in my head. Yeah. The idea is based around with the Emperor's Children is they have solid shooting, solid melee, great mobility, and awesome strats that are great for utility. That's all right. And it's just a great all-around infantry foot list that can just... Have flexibility, I feel like can deal with most any situation. Mm -hmm. Um, so how do we take advantage of that? Well, we took six troops, we took six units of noise reigns. We took four five mans, two eight mans, didn't quite go full ten because like I want more blast fest in the armies, and the eight still do very similar to a ten man. Yeah, that's fair. Um at a much cheaper cost. Mm -hmm. Then I took my necessary characters, I think, for this army, but are really, really key. You have the Dank Apostle, the Master of Dank, mm -hmm. and the Demon Prince. Or maybe Dank Prince. I don't know. A dang, I think it's Dank. a Demon Prince. Okay. Dank Apostle Demon Prince. Yeah. I like the, the mop is just amazing. He's practically just running around like a 24 inch with the relic apothecary. Uh, Vin. That's right, because the Master of Possession can heal models now. Yeah, he heals models. He reses them. He gives out five up no pains. Uh, he gives guy. plus one toughness. <laughs> he just does what he wants. What? You know? Um, and he casts three spells a turn, so he can just do all those spells. Oh, he casts three? Is that yeah, like a relic? A relic? Oh, yeah, and it gets cool. six inches range to it. Pretty so, solid. like, healing, the life of agonies, and plus one toughness, just at mm -hmm. 24, means he's just super flexible. Yeah. Uh, he's a great backfield holder uh, for your objectives and screens. Why, at the same time, having such a long range, he can stay out of deny range and support mm -hmm. still. Um, the dank, like, the apostle is just, you know, the advance and charge is a huge thing in the army. 
Definitely, yeah, if we have Honor the Prince Auto Six, so that Infusion Squad can just go yeet. Mm -hmm. um, and liking that options. And this one, I didn't take the um, Transhuman Hit Rolls Illusionary Supplication. Yep. Uh, I end up taking um, Benedictions of Darkness because I like to, some more MSG and a lot more random units. And if I'm engaging, you know, I'm engaging with everything. I want everything to be out in light cover, even in a position that may be a little bit more exposed. Mm -hmm. It's pretty nice when you have a lot of marine bodies. Yeah. Especially on, on these WTC tables, it has to be mentioned, where yeah. you can't touch the outside That's of a ruin wall. to yeah. get uh, that light cover. So there is a lot of terrain on these boards, but if you want to step out to get line of sight, you're probably on the not cover side of the wall. Exactly. And it's very easy to then have a character on the right side of the wall, not getting shot, giving light cover to his friends, yep. which on Marine Armor of Contempt bodies, because they do still have Armor of Contempt. Yep. Uh, some people were speculating about that. Still Armor of Contempt in here. Um, that's actually going to be a pretty useful box. So yeah. I, I actually like that, especially in this terrain context. Yeah. I think it's quite powerful. And then it's also to warp type plea because here's a cool thing on the inference. With warp time, you can have a noise ring unit go 18 inches and shoot you. So you put the ignore cover on that thing. It gives it real one, so it doesn't have to be in the inference range. Ignore cover, pop the strats, and just torpedo mm -hmm. and just dock away. Uh, be a lot super of flex. Um, the Demon Prince has been also has internal vendetta. Mm -hmm. He has uh, Intoxic Elixir, which once per game it gives him a wound cap in the fight phase, which can be really. I guess important. the Demon Prince has that. Yeah. All right. So you're saying I'm going to shoot him before Gullman charges him? Probably so. Yes, that's what I'm going to do. All right. Um, but he's really also good for second secondaries. Like for building this list, like I'm like these are free good secondary, free good characters because they each two of the Dark Apostle mobs just do so much, and then yep. the Demon Prince is a solid beat stick. He's also good for generally psychic secondaries when I'm mm -hmm. pushing a little bit more in the middle, either interrogating or warp ritual. Uh, yeah. Because, like, no mercy, no respite, warp ritual, um, and uh, banners is like my go to plan with this army. Awesome. Well, I'm super excited to see them in action here. Really yep. excited. This is actually my first game against the new Chaos Basement Codex, so I'm really hyped to see how this plays out. Yeah. All right. So let's talk about my Ultramarines, right? Yep. So I am back. I am running pure Ultramarines. We are running the actual Legion, no successors here. So. Ultramarines, I'm running a Supreme Command Attachment and a Patrol. Just a Patrol. Just Patrol. Just Patrol. There are six elites in this Patrol. Don't ask too many questions. <laughs> <laughs> Come this way. So what I've got here Thanks. is I have Gulliman himself. He went to clean 300 points. That is a significant drop. He was yep. way overpriced before, but 300 is actually in that realm of might be the right price. Yep. So I'm excited to get Gulliman on the table to see how he feels. And then we've got a Patrol. Uh, the logic here was that I really didn't want to overinvest in HQs and troop choices. Right. I just, and Marines, I'm sick of it. It's I, funny because you're like, I'm actually the opposite of what I want. I wanted troops and HQs. <laughs> yeah, I needed as few of those as possible. Yeah. So one patrol. Um, so I have a captain on bike and an incursor squad. The incursor just to give me a little forward to play, especially in those missions where you need to to get CP regeneration. And then, of course, um, I have um, the captain. The captain actually has some interesting tech on him because I have Goleman. I have nine CP to start with. So I actually was like, I think I can buy some Wild Trace yeah. Mallets. This is my first time trying out this Captain build. It's something that has popped up in Ultramarines before. So the Captain has a Relic Bolter that replaces his Storm Bolter, and then he's on a bike. So he puts out 12 shots total. The Relic Bolter is, it's only strength four AP dash damage one, but it rerolls wounds against non-vehicles. against non -vehicles. And then the Captain is a Warlord trait, so every time he rolls a six to wound in shooting or combat, and he has Light and Claw too, he does Immortal. So the Captain's gonna put out 12 shots hitting on twos, rolling ones. Eight of them are gonna reroll their wounds. Every six to wound is Immortal. So he's gonna just be like, up. he's just trying to sneak around the edges and be like, here's eight saves, four Immortals on whatever he's just planking shots at. Yep. Um, next up in that Elite slot, I have a uh, two man uh, company veteran squad. Uh, they no longer provide the full bodyguard, but it's still useful to have a cheap Marine unit. Uh, I actually gave them uh, Storm Shields and Power Axes to make them a little more Ultramarine flavor. But then with them as a no slot because there's a captain, I took an Apothecary and an Ancient who don't take him a slot. Yep. And that Apothecary is of course a selfless healer, and um, he's carrying the Seal of Oath, but I can pick one of your targets, and I can reroll Hudson Wounds with it army-wide. And then I gave uh, the Banner, the, uh, the Standard of McCrag, which I usually don't take, but uh, I was like, screw it, I want to take it. It's a uh, game wide, so it's, it's all game long. It's a six inch aura of plus one attack and a 12 inch aura of auto pass morale. That's nice. So, auto passing leadership checks is just kind of useful, but it's mainly he's just an aura of plus one attack. And then there's a lot of just random marines with bulk guns, and then there's eradicators, melters, everything else. I actually don't mind having an ancient to do a couple out of phase shots yep. just to see what happens because there, there's a lot of armies where that actually is kind of useful. Um, I'm thinking they're also re rolling hits and ones to wound. Um, like against knights, if you like bring out a melta squad and you shoot it, and then it dies. Well, you know, one or two guys might just 
keep shooting with four year olds hits, roll ones to wound, and get a lot yep. of extra out of phase damage. Um, then I have a 10 man Tyrannic War Veteran squad and a 10 man Vanguard Veteran squad. The Van Vets are pretty standard uh, Lightning Claw and Chain Sword with a, just a smattering of extra Thunder Hammers in there. Didn't worry about the Storm Shields because points and Armor Contempt. Yeah, points and Armor Contempt. It, it really only gives Nimble at this point. Uh, what I did do, though, was this 10-man Tyrannic War Veteran squad. It's Everyone sleeps points. on the Tyrannic War Veterans. It's a 10-man squad for 170 points. Don't ask questions. The Tyrannic War Veteran is the cheapest power armor body in the game. Yep. Uh, only Sisters of Battle are cheaper, but as far as 2-wound T4, this is the cheapest 2-wound T4 um, 3 up armor save that you can get. And a 17 points armor contempt with an AP 2 bulk gun. That'll be AP 3 intact doctrine. They're actually just useful as you bodies. Um, now, I'm not playing against Tyranids here, so we can ignore the fact that I reroll those wounds. Um, but it's just like an 85 point veteran squad with AP2 bolt guns. Like, yep. yeah, that's kind of cheap. It's like what Tacker Marines want to do have a little bit of good suppressing fire and you know, just plink wounds. Yeah, and I just love getting them to AP3 in an armor contempt world. It's like, yeah, that's actually like still, still making it. people take real saves. Yeah. Um, then uh, in that fast attack slot, I've got two uh, Stormseeker Thunder Strikes. You know, I love using my Thunder Strikes. Uh, Goldman is going to give them real ones to hit, their ballistic skill too. They're fast. They're just, I'm just trying to get a little more long-ranged uh, firepower. And then, finally, that Hex Support slot. I have one unit of Devastators. They're just walking. Multiple Marines. I'm not going to be taking Heavy Penalty. They're just walking around. And then I have a six-man unit of Eradicators. I actually combat squatted it because Mark isn't presenting with any huge, solid targets. But I figure a three-man that can step out, ignore the Heavy Penalty, and then reroll all hits all hits from Gullum and reroll ones to wound, that's still going to be plenty fine at just scraping up random um, like power armor squads, even in cover. They're going to put a lot of good work in. Yep. All right. That's my list. Oh, there's five voids in the arms. Hey, Because bonus. I was completely out of slots. <laughs> completely out of slots. And I'm like, what do I do with 40 points? Voids in the arms. Yep. Um, yeah, so uh, that's them. So are you, uh, you hyped? You ready? I'm ready. You ready? Let's do it. All right. Mark, let's talk about our deployment on the overhead. Mm -hmm. uh, what secondaries did you take? I took... Banners, assassinings. Gilliman's got to die anyway. Oh, he doesn't. Uh, then we have uh, a door or a boar, uh, something else. Or words I can't. Uh, hold on, I think I got this. Adorn the canvas eclectic. Yeah. I don't know what that does. <laughs> um, it's practically the best way to put it down is Emperor Shoulders looking at you, saying, "We're better at you, better than you." Oh. If we shoot more than you, we get a point. If we kill more melee, we get a point. If we kill more characters, our characters get to kill more of your characters, and vice versa. We get a point. If we control more objectives than you, we get a point. Uh, and if we do all four in one turn, we get a bonus point. So four different categories, which is killing and shooting, yep. killing and melee, yep. holding objectives, yep. and then um, killing with characters or killing characters? Killing characters with characters. Characters with characters. Yep. And if you win all four of those, you get a fifth point. Yep. Okay, so this will probably be one or two turns of like two to three points. And then one turn where it's oh, five, five, and, and then like maybe yeah. So when you get that point, it's like oh god. So if you start winning late game, it can snowball really hard. Exactly. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Progress towards perfection. <laughs> of course. I mean that, that's actually very fitting. Yeah. Um. So for my army here, I took uh, raise the banners high as well, uh, and because I'm planning on drawing a line in the sand and killing every chaos space marine that tries to come near it, and then I have uh, two space marine secondaries. I have um, rights of war. Uh, no, I don't. It's, um, what's the, what's the, the obvious one? O Oath of Moment. Thank you. Oath of Moment, not Rights of War. <laughs> Reading too much heresy. I have Oath of Moment, and then I have um, uh, Shock Tactics. Yep. So basically my plan here is to take the middle, and if I go second, I'll just get a bunch of points for holding the middle. And then I get points every time I take over an objective that you hold. hold. So if I move in the middle, and you don't come fight me, I'm going to try to win on primary. And if you do come fight me, I'm going to get Shock Tactics. Yep. Cool. All right, you ready for this one, Mark? Let's do it. You want to go first or second? I, you know, I'm flexible for a fat man. All right, well, let's uh, let's roll off. I've got a blue dice for my ultramarines. Yep. And we're going to just find out what the dice decide. A four, this could go either way. A six. six. Stone first, number of Slanesh, baby. Yep, that is Slanesh's number right there. Yep. All, All right. right. Book. Good stuff. Uh, let's get in command point. CP, command I base. start at four, so I'm going to go to five. Nice. Right. I'll go like to that. two. All right. All ah, right. Pathetic. I gotta do litany stuff. Uh, I don't. Hit me. Let me try to think here. What am I doing? Am I placing a banner for sure here? I am moving this unit up. With this type of list that's super flexible and technical stuff, reserves. I totally have a dread claw with two units of five noise marines in them. Oh yeah. And five warp talons and deep strike. Uh, flex. 
to break down what I have in my deployments, though, here we got eight noise marines, eight noise marines, nine chosen. They do have the relic for minus one to wound them. I forgot to put on my list. Uh, then we have two units of five noise marines. Casual minus one to wound. Yep. Love that. Okay. <laughs> so cool. Definitely when you get them to T5 with minus one to wound. The life lagging is for five, but feeling no pain. Ooh, Yay. Let's go. That's good. Demon Prince Apostle Mop here. Mm -hmm. All right. That's so sweet master possession. We're definitely going to do some of a prayer. Do I just give Warp Sight to this one to ignore cover? It doesn't matter there. Um. Maybe if you go 18 inches towards the other map, we get a line. Yeah. So, I think we're just going to end up doing uh, real hits. Because if I move up a little bit, in case some Vanguard Vets come after me, I'd like to have... No, the Demon Prince is already giving out that. So, I'll just do Warp Sight on uh, this unit. Okay. No, we'll do Light Cover, just in case. Light Cover! Light Cover! You will need Light Cover against my shots. Yep. But I've got AP. Yep. All right. And does this chaplain, does he put out one chant or two a turn? One. one he chant. has a lot of flexibility. He has three different chants. Oh, okay, so he knows quite a few. Or he knows four, because it's real hits, phantom charge, warp sight, and darkness. No four, cast one. Got yes. it. <laughs> I am a toolbox. <laughs> All right. So let's go ahead and just walk this one noise right here. Let's see that one dude right there. Uh, really? Yeah. Yeah, I just see the edge of your base. Okay, sure. All right, so you've got one guy who has line of sight to an incursor. Yep. I'm guessing that's the Blastmaster. Yep. And what are the stats on the Blastmaster? Strength 8, minus 3, free. Three shots. Three shots? Okay. Yeah, yeah what you got, Charlie? I uh, just wanted to give a shout out to George Blotter uh, with a $5 super chat. He wanted to ask you a quick question, John. Yeah, what you got? said, what is the right balance of Vanguard vets to assault Marines and White Scars? What else are you thinking for White Scars towards the next six months of Nephilim? I think that the right balance for White Scars is probably, I think, two assault squads and then, um, like, two assault Marine squads actually sounds pretty good. And then uh, I probably would have, like, 15 Vanguard veterans and just lean into like about 25 total jump pack infantry. But definitely assault marines uh, would be quite viable in uh, in uh, in the white stars. And also a question from chat from one of our members. Dante wants to know what you have chosen for seal of oath. Oh, my seal of oath target. Oh, I should do that right now. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm going to choose the chosen because they're minus one to wound and that sounds terrifying. Yep. And I'm going to need rerolls against that. Right. I am going to, for internal vendetta for my end, mm -hmm. I am choosing... Um, Glimmin, because he's yep. tough and tanky. I just need to put him down. All right. All right. Uh, noise Marines, those ones definitely have the angle. That's, yeah. That looks definitely. pretty easy. Yeah. All right. So then we're going to take these Chosen. Mm -hmm. and uh, advance them on. Whee! Well, chosen. Chosen going where they want to. Mm-hmm. Um... I think we're just going to jump inside this building for now. Mm -hmm. And then the back guy oh, does not wait. quite get it. So, how fast? Are they moving 12? Yeah, this is the front guy. This is the back guy. Oh, so, okay. I'm not quite able to get all of them on there. Aha, good, good. You so, can't hide from me. let's say gun wise, you got to get really close, to be honest. Mm -hmm. Which I think I'm okay with. Maybe I want to. Maybe you won't. Maybe, Maybe I you won't. want to. Meet me. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're gonna put this back guy right here as far as possible. Yep. These other guys right here. Looks good. All right, so we've got chosen moving out, trying to hold down that side. I like it. Yep. I think the apostle now, since he's done his stuff, eh, he doesn't get auras in. Actually, just straight up doesn't matter. Um. Oh, because he was thinking of uh, raising a banner. Yeah. Gotcha. Is there anyone else back there who could raise a banner? Like, uh, Not really, because the mob wants to do spells. Gotcha. Right. What do you got for us, Charlie? Uh, just wanted to finish that question banner. from earlier. Sorry about that. I uh, wanted to know what else you were thinking for White Scars towards the next six months. Uh, oh, gotcha. Um, you know, I oof, that's a good question. I haven't actually thought much about White Scars yet in the, in the Nephilim pack. We've had so many changes here that I haven't gotten yeah. to every army yet. Uh, in general, though, I think that you're probably going to drop the Grav Rhino from uh, White Scars in Nephilim just because it loses a lot of its threat if you're low on command points. 
Um, and it, it's not quite as scary anymore. So I think I'll probably try to phase in other types of shooting types. I experimented with this in the war room when I tried adding the land speed or, or the storm speed or thunder strikes. I don't think that was quite it though. I might actually just uh, focus on a close range army with high AP. Uh, unironically, might actually take Hellblasters in a White Scar Army, which is kind of crazy to say out loud. But uh, they are they are actually a good profile for the rule set that uh, that White Scars have. Castle just moving mm -hmm. up here. Little Mappo. All right, little Master of Possession. And we'll just kind of stay where he is. I think we're just mm -hmm. not being shot at anyway. Okay, sounds good. Um, so. He does have range where he gets everything if he wants to. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking if I want to spend a CP there to shoot and do an action. Oh. Um, I think for the memes of it, I will. Okay. Is that one CP or two? One CP. Oh, so. but I have the same thing, but but two. Bonk. Sad. Old book Bonk. problems. All right, so now right. both of these Noise Marine squads can shoot. Yep. And, uh, and one of them has raised a banner as well. Yep. So right. what we are going to do is instead of the light cover prayer, we're just going to give them a real one. Because the Demon Prince is going to want to go up there. Okay. And this is the place when I want to do, so we're just going to put that there. Sounds good. Okay. So, second phase. All right. Uh, let's give this unit a noise range right here because you can technically charge them. Oh. Um, not that you want to. Gullman, I, maybe I do. Gullman gives me plus one charge. Yeah. Whee. And we don't want to take random chinky dudes. You have more units than I do. So okay. we're going to give... Those guys, plus one toughness. All right. Uh, What's the warp charge on that? Six. Well, or seven's two. definitely going to do. Seven, maybe a seven. Okay. Not an eight. <laughs> Not an eight. All right. Um, we're going to then give them Delight Black Agnes. Ooh, the five of Thunder Pain. Yep. Solid um, on an eight. Okay. So this front squad has both of the buffs? Yep. Got it. All right. So they're T5 with a five of Thunder Pain. Yep. That's definitely going to be a pain to deal with. And then we're going to, uh, we ain't got to heal no one. Okay. Um, so we don't need to cast that. Demon Princess Warp Time, which we do not need in this case. Mm -hmm. We're just going to go into the shooting phase. Just into the shooting phase. We're going to take the Blastmaster here, shoot right here. Okay, so three shots, and then you just ignore ones. the heavy penalties, right? Yes. Very cool. Exploding Sixes, turn one. one. Oh, that does so. Twos, three wounds. This one's AP4. Those aren't AP3. Okay, so here's the AP4, Yep. which will fail. These are five ups. And we'll fail none. So nice. I'm just going to pull this guy so that I don't have to deal with this anymore. I mean, they're 48. Yeah. So I, uh, ironically, I actually need to lose a second model, I think, to get that last <laughs> yeah. red line site. But that's all right. This one, uh, well, we'll see how it goes. Okay. Roll it. So that's done. The next Ooh. Blastmaster vets on this side. Now shoots. Exploding sixes. Okay. So three hits. And then two, two saves. Two and saves. these are five ups. So yep. I, I can only lose two models at most here. Uh, I'll lose one, and that'll be just fine. Yep. Here we go. And then I think you're safe from the other one. Yep. So probably didn't check that CP. I probably didn't need to pop that strat. I should have yeah. checked that line side. Oh, well. Should have done the math of models. Yeah, and how many models are there? See? So you got to practice for progress. <laughs> Fraction, babies. No, I don't want he you to is. hold more things than me or shoot more things than me. So we got it where if you want to charge this noise ring squad, you're going to get fight last. Okay. Um, yeah, it's 2 CP though, right? Yep. Okay. So that would take you down to zero. Yep. Deal. So uh, let's think here. I think that's just really it. While, while Mark's uh, thinking, mm -hmm. uh, can we go over this terrain and the rules for it real quick? Yeah, absolutely. So let's uh, hit the top down real quick. Dun, 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 dun. So this is the WTC style terrain. Um, so this is what we're going to be playing at WTC in August, yep. and this is also very uh, common terrain format over in Europe. So I'm sure our European audiences will recognize this, but in, the, in the, uh, the North American scene, we don't get to see this style nearly as often. So what we're looking at here is we've got two cargo containers. Real simple, these are actually about the same as a cargo container. The ruins, however, are a little bit different. One of the rules that WTC plays by is that if you touch the outside of a ruin, you don't automatically count as in it. Yep. So there's eight ruins on the table here. Oh, no, there's 10. No, there's 10. There's 10. So these ones here that are a little bit smaller, these, you may not be able to tell, these are full of windows. There are windows yep. all over the place. They're only if, two stories. And they're only two stories. And if you're touching here, you're going to be seen, but they are still obscuring. These one, two, three, four in the middle, they are huge. There are no windows and they're very tall. So for example, something like the size of a knight actually could hide directly behind this from like direct on damage. Yep. Uh, now, of course, you can get angles around them, uh, and this board's designed to, uh, to reinforce that. But just to kind of give some examples, let's say this random space from here. 
Uh, obviously, he cannot see through this wall. Uh, if he comes and touches the wall, he still is not in it. Right he's not getting light cover. He's not seeing through. You have to touch the actual base of it like this in yep. order to see through it. Yep. Um, and then finally, we have four craters. But WQC puts different keywords on their craters than normal. So these keywords are both dense cover and light cover, but they are not difficult ground. Yep. So dense and light, but they don't slow you, but you do get the minus one hit. So uh, these are a great thing to be moving up into. All right. Thanks for the going over the terrain for everybody today, John. And now we're going to have a $20 super chat from Bird on Fire. Uh, he wants to ask a quick question about Blood Angels. He says, Blood Angels, what are your thoughts on two DC times four T8 squads? Oh, man. Well, I need to learn these two things. Two company times four what? T8. Oh, uh, nice four Thunderhander, uh, three Sanguinary Guard, seven man squads, and two Assault Marine with three Pasma pistols, supported by all primary troops and four characters. He wants you to tell him about his list, John. Oh, man. So I, I really like the, the three by seven Sanguinary Guard. That got just a little bit cheaper. It was already very strong. Um, I also think Assault Marine squads are right. suddenly amazing. I mean, who saw this coming, right? Assault squads are the most improved unit for Space Marines, I think, which is yep. mind-blowing that we're saying that out loud. So uh, if that all fits, that actually sounds like a really good list. That second Death Company unit is always the tricky one because you can pregame move one of them, but the one that doesn't pregame move, it's honestly still not bad if you have... It's, if it's, it's, be, it's an extra jump pack in after you already yeah. take... Everything else. Yeah, and if you have um, enough slots to, to afford it, and if there's a lot of hiding spaces, that actually sounds like a very powerful list. And late game one, well, that will be able to pop like the five up field of pain mm -hmm. ends up adding like really awkward map yeah, it, it for a be. bruiser screen unit that's just not gonna die yeah. as easily as you want it to. Also, just having the thunder hammers is like sometimes people have T7 and your secondary guard wound on fours and you just don't roll well. Having the strength eight plus one wound even with minus one to hit can be really good, and also three damage. Yeah. But angels really don't like minus one damage armies especially tough minus one damage, so anytime you've got a tool against that. That actually sounds like a very, very solid list. Yep. All right. Your turn. Gain My turn. Gain a CP. There's nothing. Uh, I will not take a leadership check on this squad because yep. of leadership nine. Ultramarines? Exactly. They don't care. All right. Okay. We are going to just tuck them in so that this doesn't happen for no reason because uh, I am not in the mood to be shot at by these guys. So he could theoretically move 18, but I don't really care if you go that hard. Actually, honestly, this is so easy to hide from that we're just going to, there you go, all right. Beep, beep. All right, he's just gonna go right there so that squad isn't shooting him. Yep. And then he will back all the way up so that this unit has to push a lot further forward if they want to shoot me. Um, they're probably gonna just be raising two banners here. I did, I'm not gonna get any points for shock tactics. In order to do that, I'd have to go take a, an objective from that noise marine squad. Yep. I'm gonna measure some charges just to see what it looks like. Um, so I've got my front van vet. Right here, this is looking like a very long charge. I probably need to roll a 10 to make it. Uh, I don't really want to just stretch out and throw away a unit that will almost certainly die in the counterattack. Um, now your noise marines, your, your chosen squad is right here. Yep. Okay, so that's the very nasty squad that I need to, need to be worried about. Um, and they could potentially advance and charge and move 12 inches with a one CP threat to auto yep. advance six. Okay, so I have to respect their threat range a lot. I do kind of want Mark to come out a little bit because I have uh, I don't want to say more guns than him, but I would like to shoot him. Uh, so, uh, and we're going to just check real quick because I would like to kill a couple guys. Now, your Dark Apostle, or I apologize, your Master Possession has a spell which can heal one model in a unit. It heals deep free wounds, and if any models have been lost, then you add a model. So it does both. Yes. What's the warp charge on that again? It's like really Five. easy, and you can be plus two to cast it. Yeah. So like, yeah. if it's If important... you have a Venom Crawl in the army, you can still roll the one's perils and still be successful. Hilarious. Um, so what I'm looking at is I could shoot these noise marines. I don't know how much damage I'm actually doing. And if I only kill one model, I've done nothing. Yeah. Because one model is going to come back basically automatically. So I might actually hold the storm speeders back a little bit. Uh, I do have bottom of turn. Right yeah, I don't want to pop out get sh and get shot back yeah. uh, a ton. But since you don't ignore cover, my marines in cover are actually relatively durable here. Um, so I think I'm going to send one of my uh, infantry squads forward to get some Oath of, Oath of Moment points. So let's go ahead and yep. advance that, uh, that two-man uh, veteran squad. Uh, they're going to add one to their advance roll, thanks to uh, Goleman being an absolute boss. Whee! Screens out. Yep. And we're just going to go touch this objective, make Mark send something to kill them, and uh, touch light cover as well. Yeah, and they will also serve as a little bit of a screen because you do have warp talons 
who could potentially, let me go right here, and right there. You have warp towns who could potentially come in and cause some problems. Yep. Um, I think I'm fine with it if you want to bring in units to ambush over here. I, uh, I'll be able to respond. Um, the question is just how much do I want to push up here? Um, I think I might take one turn of waiting and then try to push up next turn. I'm content just establishing my banners and waiting a little bit. I'll probably push my characters up a little bit though so that I've got some more established position for next turn. We're going Tyrannic War Veterans are just moving up in cover along this line. They'll probably be the thing that gets charged by, uh, by the random uh, Warp Talons if they want to come in and eat me. We'll keep these Van Vets behind. We'll use these yep. Tyrannic War Veterans to make sure that no one gets around. And if you want to deep strike nine away, it would be out here, so you're not really going to be able to get to the characters. Uh, someone has to raid this banner, though. Gilman is going to walk up just a little bit. Yep. And um, the Ancient and the Captain will be right behind him. These Eradicators are pretty happy. I don't want to bring my Vanguard veterans forward just yet, but also we don't. These are two five-man noise marine squads. Yep. The Blastmasters are the scary part of this. You ignore the if I go in dense cover, you're going to ignore that hit penalty. Yeah. yeah. So your entire army ignores dense cover, which makes me sad that there's so much nice dense cover that I wanted. What do you got for us, Charlie? Oh, um, just I was letting you finish that thought. Sorry about that. But uh, we have two super chats in the chat for you. Uh, we have one for five euros from Callum Seymour. Uh, first off, he says, "Hey guys, he loves your work and the channel. What are your thoughts on Castellans and pure Imperial Knights list?" I uh, really appreciate that. Thank you so much for your support. Uh, regarding the Castellan in a night list, uh, the Castellan is cool. Unfortunately, there's a couple of different buffs that only work on the Questorus class knights or work best on the Questorus class knights. I think you could take a, uh, a Castellan, though, especially in a Mechanicum list, where you can use that, uh, that stratagem where every six wound is just insane damage, because all of those combos still work. You just have to actually pay command points on it every time. Uh, the Castellan is still a super hard-hitting knight. I don't mind it in Imperial Knights at all. Uh, we haven't been using it much on stream because we really like stacking those Questorus uh, buffs. But if you want to just get good raw stats, Dominus class knights still do hit really hard. Yep. All right, and we have another five euro super chat mm -hmm. from Andrew Dunkley. Uh, mm -hmm. He wanted to say, Space Wolf successors, are they worth the two CP to take armor of Russ or just give up the reactive fight last? I think it is. Like, yeah. fight last is such a game breaking mechanic. Double with the six inch heroic mm -hmm. and fight control. If you are a CC player, yeah. I think it's still only one CP for armor of Russ. Maybe, but I mean, if. Yeah, yeah, you, you spent the, but the strategy for successor gives you a relic. Right. Yeah. So, yeah. Well, like, I think it's only one CP, but definitely still worth taking armor breast. Yes. It's, it's such, fight last is such a crucial ability, especially in the way space wolves are built. I yeah. would recommend it. Yeah. All right. Flight control. So my only real question then is if I'm sending any infantry squads forward onto this, uh, this light cover piece. So if I push up to like right here, it's hard for you to get an angle down this side. You have to kind of push out to there. Which you could do, you, but you have to spend some resources like on the Prince of Warp Time yep. or bring in the pot over here, which I'm not mad about. Um, same thing if you want to shoot down this angle, you kind of have to, again, advance forward right into the open or bring down the pot. I think I am going to try to sneak a couple of models right up here and just see what happens. Okay. Um, mainly because I think Mark is a little bit faster than me and I don't want to sit back and then have him also while he's faster than me because then I won't get there in time. So we're going to, we, we didn't use the Van Vets there. But I think I could probably push them up here and then just run the Apothecary up. So we'll actually leave a spot for that Apothecary. And we're going to bring up just some Vanguard veterans right like this. Now, just to project some threat. Just project a little bit of threat. See if I can get Mark to commit some units. Yep. Because um, I am not a coward and I want to start shooting. I'm going to come forward. Mark, feed me units. I'll work on it. Thank you. Okay. So you've got a noise marine squad right up against that wall. Yep. So they could definitely just advance out and they could shoot me because a lot of their weapons are assault. Um, if I do that, I'm going to get hit by a lot of things. I know I just said I'm not a coward, but I think we're actually going to give it one turn and see where your reserves come in if they do it all, and then we'll think about pushing out. Okay. All right, we're going to hold off. Yeah, I forgot about that squad. That is, yeah. I think, one yeah, too many good. units that could just go hit me, and I will fail saves eventually. All right. So I'm raising two banners. What colors do you use? Did you use uh, green? I use green. All right, perfect. So I'm going to raise some red banners. Yep. And cursors are raising right there. And then that's going right there. Um, I've already screened out this backfield pretty well, enough that a dread claw is not going to be fitting in it. So Mark's going to have to land in front of me. 
this thunder strike I think is going to move out to here just so that it's going to have a better shot at uh, placing angles next turn. But this yep. one's going to stay back to preserve that screen. Gotcha. Um, and my character shuffled up a little bit, but I'm, I'm kind of waiting for Mark to make the first move. And also, he does have to do something because there's a unit there that just could do something. I mean, like, if you just shoot a unit of Storm Shields in cover without like really committing to it, there might just be a dude left. Yep. And like, all true reason don't fail morale checks. Yep. So uh, I think Mark's going to have to send at least one resource slightly forward. We'll, we'll see what it does. Yep. All right. Tactical doctor time. Tech doctor. All right. Uh, end of the turn, mm -hmm. or start of my turn, we've broken again ACP. Yep. Oh, man, this is Bonk. great. I have seven command points, Mark. Then I am going to get two banners. Yes. I think any of the Emperor's Children ones, because nothing died. Uh -huh. I didn't control more objectives than you. Mm -hmm. um, and All part of my plan, there. you see. Yep. See, if nothing dies, then Mark doesn't get secondaries. So at some point, Mark Shanks. might have to step up. Yep. To find so out. let's see if I get Darkness up. Darkness. And these chants pass on a two as long as the apostle, apostle has his has, friends. Yes. Quite handy. All right, so here's the question is how much do I try to deliver a punch mm -hmm. back? Um, let's see if I want to plink away some make you. van vets. So Blastmasters wanted to get mm -hmm. right there to yep. be able to get two damage. Noise Marines can also go 18. Mm -hmm. So let's say the back guy can go right here, mm -hmm. who's all within 12. Uh, the back guy would not have 12 inches. Okay. Um, so like we can put, we, uh, put parts to there, but I don't think we're going to do it yet. I think mm -hmm. we're just going to control our targets. We may send a unit over here to mess up your primary and a banner placement with some warp talents. Yeah. Um, I see that's a good use for them at this moment. Yeah, that's probably true. Uh, because then it gives me next turn having another reserve on the Prince charge mm -hmm. set up. I hate that. So... <laughs> What we're going to do here is just going to do some shuffle. Yep. Yeah, I'm just trying to get Mark to uh, commit some resources to me. Yep. So. Oh, at the end of the battle round, I'm going to score um, two points on Oath of Moment. Gotcha. Because I did not fail okay, morale check fall back, and I do hold that center point. Yep. Fully within six. So we're going to take these guys and just walk to see him. Yep. That's pretty easily. Right of this corner here. Mm -hmm. So it looks like the Blastmasters aren't getting in half range. No, sorry, the, the Blastmasters are. The, the Sonic Blasters are not. Yeah, yeah. Um, 24, yeah. So I want to see how much... Are. Yeah, but I'm trying to think if I want to get with an 18. Not really. No. Well, I can get one, I can get one like, with an 18. Yeah. Just come a little bit two. closer, Mark. I'll get a second I, one. I'll get a second I'm one. waiting five, five. for you. Yes. I will get two at 18, because then there's 12 shots there, two damage. Oh, that's cool. And then we will just walk these guys up as well. Okay. So just trying to get the volume now. Yeah, yeah definitely the shots. this unit's getting hit. That's, I think, just the reality. I think I can really pick them up with those guys, or at least take you off the objective. Very good. Um, then uh, these guys, mm -hmm. uh, you ain't got no reserves. So I think we're going to... That's true, yeah. You, you, <laughs> you don't need to screen for me. I'm getting to your objective by walking through yeah. your army. Walking at you, no, your noise brains. So they're just going to go eight. Sure. Um... Should totally move the apostle first. <laughs> He's no, just no, walking. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. John, what's that unit on the center objective? That center unit on the objective is a unit of two company veterans. They are a uh, relatively cheap unit, just going there to hang out. Yep. Forty point base is really important for yeah. a space marine army. I, I paid a little extra points because mine are modeled with um, shields and uh, power axes. Yep. In the typical uh, McCraggian fashion. A little McCraggo fashion. Mm -hmm. All right, warp talons though. We got to oh, set your tempo. We got to make you feel uncomfortable. So well, I feel great right now. I don't know what you're talking I know, about. I know. <laughs> yes, right. warp talons. Spend command points to charge me. My, my three man incursing squad. Oh no. <laughs> you're the, the die anyway. Yeah, no, the incursors um, are about to die. But chosen got to advance though for sure. Yep. If they can't stay around. We have to move an eight. Mm -hmm. So well, okay. we're just moving up here. Looking very intimidating. Yep. They sure are. Probably put all of the defense buffs on them this turn. Yep. We make them T5 uh, and Delightful Agonies. The mm -hmm. chances that you actually hurt the squad with a Van Vet unit you know, is practically... Yeah, Van Vets are certainly not. <laughs> yeah. Van Great Veteran have much smaller fish <laughs> to fry. <laughs> so the mop goes up. Yep. And the, the range of his spell just... They're 24 because he's plus 6 inch range. Yeah. Ugh. All right. 
I was like, I don't know, Mark, you looks a little bit far from the bus, yep. but 24 inches is pretty good. Yep. Oh, yeah, you've, you've got 24. No, <laughs> not a question in my mind. Yikes. Okay. That's really long. Okay. So, spells. Spells. All right, spells. what you got for me? Uh, plus one top of this one, the Chosen Squad. Yep. Uh, goes off. Actually, I think six. we're not. We're gonna just do the lifeful agonies on. Let me not gonna roll that dice. Okay. I think I want to do plus one strength here on this unit because then I'm gonna you on freeze naturally because it targets demon kin. So we want to go here. Okay. Plus one strength there. Fails on fails. a four. Fails. That's fine. Okay. Um. Could have done two plus two to cast, but I don't think it mattered. Because then you have to do D three mortals to yourself to, something. to someone to, nearby. To someone nearby. Okay. Which I think I'm just okay with. Okay. Um. Then uh, need to get in practice to do that afterwards. Mm -hmm. Then uh, we're going to do uh, uh, dirt, the lightful agonies on the chosen one. The chosen. The safety. Perilous. Perilous. Oh no! Oof. So I think he's just going to take it. Yep. Does he have one wound left? Uh, or he did has he five. go to? He said he went to five. Yeah. Okay. And then he's just going to heal himself. <laughs> he gets a third spell. Yes, bird cast with a relic. Ah. Yes. Okay, so he heals D three. One. One. Ha ha! Two wounds he, left. Two wounds left. So if you perils next time, that, it to will be system. hilarious. Yep. That's all I have to say about that. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's do the first unit of noise rings there. Okay. And so now they've got a ton of shots coming yes. in at this company that spot. Six with the Blastmaster. Yep. No explodes. I'll take it. Is this an assault profile? It is an assault. Nice. Strength five. That's AP three. This is AP two. Okay. Two damage. All right, so that AP3, which you're going to take four up. Uh, good. And then AP2 on the other one. Yep. Um, I don't have armor contempt, so I have a one up and cover goes to the three up. Yep. Because I have a, a shield instead. It'll fail. Kill a dude. Um, what are the stats of what's coming at me here? The rest of them is just going to be 12 strength four shots. AP ones. Damage Could one. Could be AP. Yeah, damage one. Six of the wound are going to be at this one. I'm going to, I have seven command points. I'm going to spend a CP to okay, see if I can okay. get a three up here, because I might actually be able to take this. And then there's no one to charge me. Yeah. I got never unit to shoot you. Where's the other unit? There's two five mans there. Oh, it's two five mans. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, I made it, so now I'm just gonna get shot again. All right. Okay. Shoot, I thought that was one squad. Me. Okay. Exploding sixes. Not amazing hits though. Just the one stays in. Yeah, there you go. Uh, okay. Fours. This is AP two. Okay. I think you're just straight ignoring all that because light cover anyway. Uh, I don't have armor contempt, so oh, I'm yeah. only ignoring the AP one. So yep. the AP one. Wounds the guy, so one guy is wounded. Okay. Okay. And then the next unit, because I really want to confirm that kill. Yeah. And everyone has line of sight too, right? Yes. Okay, so there's no amount of casualty. We're going to do six of the wound or mortal wounds. Oh. Yeah, yeah, that'll probably do it. We'll do, well, save the blast master. We'll do the four, mm -hmm. the small volume shots first, because you already have a wounded guy. Okay. So, 12 shots. Exploding sixes. Hits are a little weird today. That looks pretty good. Yeah. No mortals. Okay. And so these are all AP1. All AP1. So these are all two ups. I've already used my reroll. So we're yep. just going to be an absolute boss. Oh, no. We, we have one guy left. Oh. All right. Six shots in the last master. Okay. Yeah, cut the clothes. sixes. Two sixes. Nice. So two of those stay in. Yep. Sixes are mortals. All you're right. just so at you, the mortals. You got some mortals right there. Okay. Second unit does me in. All right, so sad. Sadly, he is dead. All right, so definitely did not need to reroll that. Second squad, sad. All right, big flyheads. All right, any other shooting? No, that's. I think that's it. Because you just kind of hit, I kind of hit. We're being a passive, waiting for the right time. We're gonna do onto the prince here. Mm -hmm. So three up, twelve. Okay. So does that put you at zero CP? That will put me in no one. Oh, because you went up to three. Yes. Got it. So back down to one. Yep. So okay. we're just gonna go right here. Yep. Um, I think we're gonna go ahead and touch it because, like, honestly, you're mm -hmm. gonna get shot. Well, yeah, you have to to, yeah. to, to get me. So. Well, if I went over here around you. Oh, fair. Yeah. But uh -oh. I think I'll just take the light cover because I'll be getting shot. even if I'm right here, you're mm -hmm. gonna still shoot me with a lot of stuff. That's probably. true. hundred <laughs> percent. Um, that, that. And then an infantry squad will walk yeah. over too because I've got a lot of guns. Right behind yeah. Back. So it does force your hand to get out. A little bit more at a different angle. Mm. Oh, do, 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 do. Versus versus. Let's think here. Mm -hmm. That goes there. We shoot down now. Yeah. Uh, you don't have ignore cover. I don't. Yep. No ignore cover. I have cover. an in bone, so melt the shots are not. The eradicators aren't really shooting me then if I'm over here. 
The, that squad isn't, yeah. I, yeah. The squad over here might be able to. Yeah. The Devastators definitely are. I think we're just going to go ahead and go right here just to make it okay. very minimal on what you can shoot me with. Sounds good. All right. So, so all inch. getting within half an inch of a friend? Yep. All right. So we got five attacks each, six on the sergeant. Casual. Yep. So these are AP2, right? AP2, six is our AP3. Six is our AP3 because you're Ember's shoulder. Got it. Yep. And re-rolling the wounds. That would have been a great if I had uh, splitting sixes up on my okay. now. So 25 attacks. Looks like 26. six missed. Oh, that's pretty. 20 hits, though. That's pretty good. Yeah. That is an insane amount of sixes. I'm glad we're intact, Doctor. <laughs> what's, what's the name of the, the Doctrine for Space Marines? Uh, which Doctrine? Like so the one that you're in right now. I think I'm in Wonton of Massacre. Uh, Massacre, yes. Wonton Massacre, all right? No, it's Wonton. Wonton. Okay, Wonton. this is extremely survivable, but there are reroll wounds. Reroll wounds. <laughs> so it's about to get a little bit worse. Yep, that hurts more. Yep, sixes are AP3s. Yes. We got four AP3s. Okay, so let's just do the four AP3s first. Yep. Boop, boop, boop. Uh, five ups here is going to kill a guy. Yep. So I've got two models left. If this was a full health squad, I would feel a little bit better about my odds right. of surviving, but right now it's unlikely. I'm going to do it a little slow just in case I want to spend a command point. Okay. Here's the first five. Uh, that'll kill the squad, squad right there. So that's <laughs> the rest of this is no longer necessary. So you do get the one kill right there. Yep. And then we're just going to go right here. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're just going to come right there and get there. Okay. So I'm going to have to come out and kill these warp talents. Yep. No problem. But they're not in cover, which uh, on Which's the one hand means that they're going to fail saves a lot more. On the other hand... Does mean You're not shooting me with Meltas. Yeah, the, this castle's probably not shooting you. They're going to have to go shoot those. Yeah. Ones. All so, right. That's it. End of my turn. Oh, let me check the upper shoulder one if it checks. I believe it checked at the end of the round. I would, I would hope so. <laughs> that would have been hilarious, <laughs> you actually. You more shooting than I do in your turn. That's not fair. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, which is why it's really good at if you go second. Okay. Gotcha. Okay. So I killed one melee, one shooting. Yep. No problem. And then there's still an entire pod that can come in. All right, so we're going to go ahead and um, get the party started. You have three models on this objective, so if I want to raise the banner with these voidsmen, I just need to outnumber you, um, which looks pretty easy to do. Um, I'm probably not going to be able to get a second kill here. I'm just going to look at getting one and holding this objective to deny you to hold more. Yeah. And you can get either the, you'll either get to shoot more or the, the fight more. Right, you I'm not getting both. You shouldn't get both as long as I remove this threat. And then. Um, uh, you, no one else came up to here, so that's just the, the oath of moment point, which is probably not that necessary. All right, so let's uh, work on that then. Yep. Um, do, do, do. So these, these are five man noise blades. Yes. How fascinating. So I might honestly just boost up the thunder strikes, just put one right here, one right behind it, and just try to um, clean out one of those uh, noise marines pods. Mm -hmm. um, hitting on twos, rolling ones, they don't have any buffs right now, they're not in light cover. So not actually that hard to kill them. Uh, the squad behind is toughness four minus one to wound. Yeah. But I get my full rerolls against them. Toughness four minus one to wound. Yeah. And uh, the life five. Yeah, I don't actually want to um, shoot them because I don't want that, that chosen squad to start growing models towards me. Yeah. That's the scary situation That'd be bad. <laughs> that I want to avoid. Kill two models and cross six turn, that's a lot of movement. That can be scary. Yeah, exactly. So we're going to walk up voidsmen. Walk up voidsmen. And see, this is something that Emperor's Children, they very much want to play this little angles and try to control the game mm -hmm. with little things. And then uh, they're trying to set up their, for their perfect attack where they all just hit it once and it just tries to clean the house at that point, right? Oh, I gain a command point with the seven. And you're up to two, right? Yeah, okay. up to two. Um, I actually don't realistically think I'm going to be raising this banner, so we're going to uh, advance the Voidsman. Okay. Uh, they're going to go much farther. Yep. Yay, screens. <laughs> Help, screens. They, they can die if they want to. <laughs> It is a okay with me. Uh, you don't. You can heroically uh, intervene for one CP. Yes. Right. Yep. Okay. Characters do it six inches. Right yeah, units, I'm totally within three. Frankly, if you're alive, I'm probably gonna charge you. Yeah. Or not quite space wolves. Yeah. We'll just stay out of three, of everyone except the front guy. So if okay. you want a heroic, you have to keep that front guy alive. Okay. And then because um, he's gonna be very easy to get line of sight to. Yeah. So to, speaking of getting line of sight to him, is here. Mm -hmm. This line, so I think I can either walk Marines right there and just do it, which actually will probably take care of it right there. So I think we'll just step out the grab squad. They should just remove that immediately. 
And then at that point, the thunder strikes aren't actually contributing. Because this, I, I literally think the grab squad alone gets this, because you just get a, a five up save or you die. Yeah. I'm going to put like a bunch of stops. I'm going to put like nine emblems on you. And then I'm going to have three other units point at you. And that, hopefully that does it. Um, the Tyrannic War Veterans will touch here just okay. in case I need a little bit extra support. Yep. Um, yep, that looks fine. Um, so you've got this little pocket right here, which this is an eight man. Eight man, eight man. So both eight mans are right here. Yep. Okay, I'm seeing this. All right, and they can potentially go 12 and then charge. Yes. All right, so they just move 12 is what we're going to pretend. Anything yeah. within 12 plus uh, Honor the Prince, mm -hmm. anything within 20 inches is auto guaranteed charge. Yeah, that's terrifying. Yeah. Um, <laughs> 19. Yeah, because you move 12, you can you potentially only charge 7. Oh, right, you're, you're, seven, oh, you're, you're less than 20. Yeah, yeah less than 20. Yep, 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 yeah. yep. 100%. Yeah, that's scary. So, so you can go right there. Um, so let's just examine these firing lines. So I think one Thunder Strike is going to just boost out to here, mm -hmm. just to take some pot shots at that guy. And then um, these Eradicators and all these are not really doing much because this angle it's is too, that's too sharp. I have to get in front of this wall to shoot you. Yep. I'm not going to get it from that side. So I have to be in front of the wall. So I might actually walk the eradicators up in front and just drop a couple of melters on you. But I think I can afford to. Okay. Um, uh, see, the, the, the goal here, Mark, is that you're going to come shoot me and then I'm going to shoot on death. And you're just going to be too confused. The ironic. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> These Empress <laughs> children aren't ready to get shot on death. All right. So we have to get guys out of the way. Now we are definitely going to come forward. Yep. I, I'm a patient man, Mark, but when I see heretics, i got to purge them. Purge. There's no way around it. Uh, shockingly enough, my, my Space Marine Army doesn't have a command phase. Uh, so it's really weird, isn't it? It kind of is. I don't know how I pulled that one off. I, I don't. No, no, no command phase to be found. Gullimans before rules of before command yeah, phase. Ultramarines are old, and I didn't take the other stuff. All right, it is uh, the wonderful tactical doctrine, which means that this heavy penalty doesn't actually exist. Yep. Always love that. Sarge will uh, just step out there. Uh, these van vets could move forward to try to put a finishing blow on here if I wanted to try to be cute and deny you both points, but I just don't think that's actually worth the time. No. Um, I don't want to give you... So here's a question, is how good are, are you is Emperor's Children at moving multiple units around the battlefield. I mean, I the, the army advances and shoots with no penalties. I, I mean, it's charging. Oh, charging, like If I yeah. put, like, five guys here in cover, because it, it took both of these squads to kill a two-man in cover and some CP investment. If I put a five-man here, I don't think you actually kill it without Well, investing. once you get within 12, it's there too damage. True, but if, I, I want you forward. Yeah, yeah. True, true. I, I want you to step to this spot, because this is the spot that my entire army can see. Um, all right, so I think we're just going to um, have these Vanguard veterans walk out and they're actually going to step up here and raise a banner. Okay. So I outnumber you and I may choose to fail this action if I decide that shooting you is in my best interests. Yep. Um, but I'm going to just step him out, tell it raise the banner, and then put everyone else uh, here in cover. Gotcha. Ooh, yep. Precious cover. Sweet, sweet precious cover. You know I like having cover. And yes, you can 100% start, uh, come out and shoot them, but I think I'm just going to be giving you uh, a number of targets. And it's two five mans in here, right? Yep. Okay, yeah, that, that's just, this is going to happen. All right. Couldn't stomach your cowardly ways any longer, Mark. Pew, pew, pew. So I think only two eradicators are actually going to get to this spot. The third guy looks like he's a little bit too far back, and he's not going to, the back of his base won't clear the yeah. ball. So he may not get the shot. Um, these Tyrannic War veterans will don't want to just step out for the sake of it. They're not really going to be shooting anything. So they're just going to advance. Yep. Uh, so they're going 10 with Gulliman, which I love that. So we're going to go do the exact same thing as before, and we're going to go touch this. Mm -hmm. And we're going to get just barely on it. I can't get my... Uh, this is unfortunate, actually. I cannot get my uh, shock tactics until Mark comes onto this objective. <laughs> if he shoots me off of it, I don't get points. <laughs> so I need him to actually send units up, and then I want to charge them with Gulliman. Because charging people with Gulliman is what I'm here for. <laughs> this uh, is the way. We're actually going to put a couple more forward to make sure that I'm getting my oath of moment points. 
Yeah, yeah six, that's true. Holy six to center means that they're going to Could they actually, all still actually get it, Vink? I think some of the guys in the back. Um, you had them over there close to the apothecary? Yeah. Yeah, so that's a question. Well, let's just see what 16 inches from the center was. Can you tell me when that's over the center? Yeep. Um, that is admittedly a lot closer than I thought. So mm, let's say no, okay. uh, because yeah, I'm because I think you had one guy right next to the apothecary. Close yeah, to the no, I, I, I did. So let's say it's yeah. no then, and we're let's see. it's only one point on oath a moment, but we'll just instead put four guys in cover behind the wall, one on the objective. Yep. So if Mark commits a lot of guns, I may cut my losses here. We'll make that decision later. Um, actually, I should probably just spread out and soak the the screen screen job. Nah, that's all right. I'm going to let Noise Marines charge my, uh, Noise Marines are allowed to charge Vanguard veterans. If you want to come over here, we will fight. <laughs> it'll be, I think it'll be okay. Do, do, do. These Van Vets are moving out of the way of the Eradicator so the Eradicators can step forward. That's gotcha. what we want to do. Okay. Come on. So, yeah, so these two are clearing. He is not. So, so we'll get some Arads out. Boop. Which one's the multi -milta? Uh, The front guy. And then um, that'll be good. So we've got two guys that can shoot here. Yep. That actually might pick up an entire squad by itself, Pretty hilariously. Uh, we'll find out in a second. That's probably already dead, these eradicators. Because you double your number of shots or do you double shoot with eradicators? Good question. Because if you double shoot, I could take you out of line. Yeah, you side. can take out. Uh, I think it's shoot again. Um, I'll check that in a second. Actually, if you want, this basement codex is right on the table. While I keep moving, if you actually wouldn't mind grabbing that. Come here, Codex. This Eradicator squad will advance because they don't have any shot options. You lied to me! Oh, never mind. It's on the counter, not the table. Okay. They're going eight. Pseudo happy lie. Happy yeah. turf. Yeah, they're not really doing anything. The Eradicators are pretty happy here. All right. Why is this book so thick but so empty? I mean, oh, ouch. <laughs> that hurts. Um, This one Thunderstrike, I think, is 50%. Can shoot warp talons if they're alive. Yeah, shoot twice. Shoot twice. Okay, yes. so I'll so I'll have to resolve it. Check line of sight after I resolve it. And yep. if you do your job right, that will then lead to me not doing it again. I hope I can do my job. Right. Where is you the? Know, I'm um, never quite sure. Where is the squad at end? The squad. So it is five dudes right here. Okay, so this is the Sorry, second squad. Yeah, this is the second squad. This is the five man right there. Okay, so so if I see both of these models, I have line of sight to two units. Okay. So yes. Because right. these are the two Blastmasters. Oh, these okay. are the two Blastmasters. From each squad. Oh, okay. So this is where I want to... Ha. I do like having long range. All right. While well, John's checking that range, we got a $2... What's our one gun, actually? Is it 9 or 8? 10. Ten. Ten? Oh, uh, we have a $2 super chat from Frosty Forge. Frosty! Uh, he's excited for the Noisy Boys, and he wants to ask Mark, where are the flatbed keys? Oh, <laughs> let me try to think. I think I brought them inside the house. They may be on some counter... Inside the farmhouse, I'm not sure where. This um, is the most marked Maybe in my pocket, on top of the uh, microwave. <laughs> maybe on top of the uh, sandwich press. Or right next to the counter on my bed. I feel like we should give the context to the mm. chat that Frosty Forge is also my our boss. dear friend and also Mark's <laughs> boss. Yeah. Um, so, <laughs> this is the greatest thing that I've ever... I, was, I, I took him out because like I was going to be gone. I've just gotten in the habit of taking the keys out of the truck. <laughs> So the angle to so shoot this guy is basically that line. So you'd, you'd have to step forward, which I don't think you're very opposed to. It's probably going to happen anyway. Uh, I don't think it's worth bringing this guy out just yet because you're going to commit at some point, I Mark. want to shoot you, though. Yeah, I don't want you to shoot him. I like nom, the fact nom, nom, I don't want to give you one unit that is not in front of and bonka, doesn't bonka. get light cover. <laughs> really liking this whole light cover situation I got going on here. Um, you know I can pop two CP ignore it. That's not true at all. <laughs> I, I'm, just I'm fully aware that that's not true. <laughs> um, I think I got jacked for half a second. And he's like, wait, what? Yeah, I, I know that ain't real. Uh, if I want to shoot this guy, yeah, I have to put something right there. Um, probably not worth it. Okay. Okay. So these eradicators are just going to shimmy over. We're going to stand that banner right within six inches of them, of that one guy. Then he's within six inches over here, so I've, I'm controlling all three of these are potentially shooting on death. Um, the van vets are fine. The apothecary uh, will advance. Uh, yeah, the apothecary will advance. I'm just going to move back a little bit here because I think your clearance requires you to. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Appreciate that. 
There we go. Apothecary oh, yeah. likes being in auras and giving people buffs. He's actually going to step it right there. And then Gulliman isn't really doing anything this turn, which makes me incredibly sad because I would like you to step up into the fun zone. Yeah. Work on it. Come on. Just, just waiting for the right opportunity. It's perfect come opportunity. Come on over. Just come on over. Um, and if I want to shoot you at this point, because those are noise marines right there, I have to step out to here. I actually don't hate the idea of moving a storm speeder out here, just pot shotting. Put a dice on the back of his base. Here we go. Am I gonna have thirty-six? So I do have the thirty-six from the base. Yep. Let me just make sure that I can actually see you. Oh yeah, yeah, that's a guy. Yeah, just take three shots. You've already got a ton of opportunity over here. I kind of want you to land right there. That feels like the fun spot. Okay, then. Uh, we'll, we'll hold off. One more turn. All right. Hold turn. Let's do it. I'm going to shoot you now. Um, let's go ahead and shoot the uh, grabs right here. Okay. Uh, plus one uh, ballistic skill going on a multi melter. Here are the grabs. And we'll do that so that he can see all the little okay. Just in case. Grab. Threes, we're rolling ones. Oop. And threes. There you go. All invulns. All invulns. Because your AP like four, right? It'd be three. Okay, okay. that's a squad. Cool. All right. Well, then the rest of the weapons don't fire. Yep. And that is good. Um, that means that the Vanguard veterans will not be charging and will be raised in a manner. Yep. Okay. Uh, we're going to shoot two eradicators here. Yep. Here is a multi multa and here is a not multi multa Gotcha. Gilly. All right. And these are twos. Yep. Rolling ones, one, two, three, AP, four. One of them auto kills you, two of them would roll a one on damage to not kill you. Because the multi melt does not have Yeah, you, you still get saves. Yeah. I'm just okay. saying that roll, roll them separately. Like roll one. One. He's good. Two guys I have to roll damage for. Yep. Okay, kills two guys. Two guys. Uh, whatever units can currently see them? Okay. No, not really. Yeah, if you if you pull the Blastmaster, then. But what else can currently shoot them anyway? That the Eradicators. Know. Oh, because I shoot again. Yeah, oh, right. I pull. <laughs> I pull this one. I forgot about that. Yep. Yeah, you got to pull the the blast master to get out. Pull the black, and then I'm just gonna. I can bring back the life. The blast. Master. You can bring the the blast master back to life. Yep. Yep. All right. So oh, you just okay. killed two little guys there. Took out of sight. Yep. Uh, so they will not be firing a second volley. Uh, they advanced. Um, I should really thought this was gonna take a little more effort. Yeah, but you know. Um, uh, but that's okay. Um, so that's me. Yep. I'm gonna get one point on oath of moment because yep. I don't really do the morale check or fallback thing. Um, I only got one point on raise the banners here. Yep. I only got and one. You only got four on primary. Only got four on primary. Yep. And uh, we're passing it back to Mark. All right. End of my or start of that turn. I will get. Um, I did at least get one point for. Uh, yep. You killed more than canvas. You combat. Yes. So you so get one point. point on canvas, two points on banners. Yep. But your assassinate is still waiting it's, for later. It's waiting for late game. Mm -hmm. Same as your shock tactics. Yep. All right. So can you CP? Conka. Gain of CP up to eight. Pop now, of three. We're definitely moving into the one time of punchy punch, shooty shoot. Is it destruction? Slaughter. slaughter. Yes. Wanton slaughter. Okay. Wanton slaughter. <laughs> Wanton. All right. So <laughs> at this point, we have reserves that are coming in. Yep. So we're, we're getting to the violence. I didn't really want to step out into the automatic charges that were coming at me. Yep. So we're just going to let you come yep. break upon the, the, the anvil of Ultramar. Uh, not yet. My shock tactics is sitting at a. Oh no! I hold this. Yeah. So I got three points on shock tactics. Nice. Because you yeah. killed the hold. Yeah, it's it's like a uh, the glory one. Yep. Or, yeah, because uh, I, I I hold this now and you held it at that at the end of the turn. Yep. So three points on shock tactics. Nice. So that's actually only a one point play, funny enough. Yeah. I forgot about the shock tactics on that one. Woo! Some derp. Ha ha. All right. So. Let's sink here. Two point play because I took it out on a banner. Oh, you did take that. You took it out on a banner once. Which is nice when we're playing this banner marine war. Yeah, I do. Do hate that. Um, let's sink here. We're definitely I think gonna do um, move up. Mm -hmm. And do we do warp side? I think so. We just want to ignore cover uh, with this unit of torpedoes. Apply pressure. Mm -hmm. We probably drop the drop pod right here. Yes. So let's see where. What's what's this looking like? We're gonna drop that drop pod. We're probably gonna get out, charge stuff. Mm -hmm. Um. And be happy. Yep. So, uh, 
So let's sink here. I don't like anything about that position. If you put that land speeder, I probably would have moved some stuff over there, but still not dropped. Just because mm. I wanted to kill a sting, but I can probably still get... I can get an angle from it right here with two Blastmasters, which sounds pretty good. Yeah, yeah. Oh. If you drop in that same angle that the that the, the, the warp towns were at, that's where I was. Yeah. But you wouldn't be within 24 of me. Uh, no, but I'm still free damage. That's not terrible. Um, And bracketing you is always a good thing. Mm -hmm. um, making you freeze rolling ones is a whole lot different than two rolling ones. 100% is. Um, so I think we're going to think about that. We're probably going to do, we're going to do warp site plea. Warp site plea? Yep. And that's the ignore line of sight. Or the ignore, ignore cover, cover real ones. ones. Yep. All right, who's getting it? Uh, nobody, nobody is. No ah, one. Good, Which good, is, good. Okay. I wanted that light cover, Mark. I wanted it. I know. I wanted I noticed. It. And now that means that you don't get the advance in charges this turn either. Right? That's a never later. I can't do both. I yeah, do exactly, exactly. Later. You only do one or the other, so you can't get yeah. the advance in charge. Okay, yeah. cool. I'm not doing the advance in charge. I'm not worried about charging. I just want two food. No. All right. Seems legit. So I still think this is the play. We put both Blastmasters here. Mm -hmm. We put the Sonic Blasters. We can still get 12 inches. Mm -hmm. um, so we could also put the Blastmasters on those Havocs, which actually sounds pretty good. Havocs. And then Havoc I have Havocs. Devastators. Thank you. That's good value, too. Mm -hmm. Um, so uh, let's sink here. Mm -hmm. Let's see it. We definitely probably want to kill these guys. So we can take these guys and go 12, hit them, hit them, hit them. Go to 12? With this unit noise rings up to 18. Oh, if, if they advance in. Got yeah. It. Okay. Do all that shindig. Advance and warp time. Okay. Yep. Yeah, I'm definitely getting hit by the noise brings or by the Empress Shielding this turn. Uh, I don't think Mark can afford to wait forever on that yep. one. But uh, you have bomb a turn, which is a real big advantage, I think, actually here. I really actually really did want to go second when I think about ah. it. Because my secondary would have played about well around that too. Yeah, well just as planned. Yep, just as planned. Mm -hmm. hmm. So we get out here, we auto advance uh six, so we can just pretty go if we want to. I think that's the play. I'm gonna go to one CP onto the prince. Yes. And okay, so it's clean 12 inch move on this noise marine unit. They're gonna have line of sight to a ton of options, yep, me... but they're not going to have um, the ability to charge. Get fingers in here. Okay. And then, um, correct me if I'm wrong, the Blastmaster has an, an assault profile? Yes. Okay, so you'll still be able to shoot, but you won't be able to shoot the heavy portion yep. of it. Awesome. And this is an eight man squad coming right at me. Very, very scary. That guys, and we're gonna totally warp time in the move of number six. Okay, so they're gonna just try to get as deep as possible and be a real problem. Yeah, they nice. would have been nice having the reroll ones, mm -hmm. um, and all that stuff. And the nor cover would have been nice for this torpedo. Yeah, but I don't think I will go as quite as deep, but pretty, still probably pretty deep. Sounds good. Uh, all right, we got a five dollar super chat from Sin Lord. He wanted to ask a quick question. He says, "Hey, Art of War team, what units in the new?" Chaos Space Marine book, would you use in a Bellacor list? Yep. Considering Obliterators oh. or Terminators, which units would you pick? Good luck and have fun today. Thank you so much. We really appreciate your support. Mark, this is a question for you. So, like, basic Chaos Space Marines are really valuable. They were corn, you're just walking up like Strength 5, AP 2, mm -hmm. Teleports. Oh, like the, 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 the troop durability. Unit. Yeah, even this is the troop unit mm -hmm. because it adds that extra good troop unit on top of the demon troops and a hardcore melee unit that's OPSEC. Mm -hmm. Um... I really probably actually like bikers in that army with all the buffs that you can get just do like mm -hmm. since you can put a spell and make them unshootable uh you can chapter master them come up with nurgle bikes and just say yeah. if you can do that make them unshootable take like another unit of nurgle put it up there make it unshootable and then put just some plague top. bears in front of pink cores in front of it yeah um so anything that like i think nurgle has a lot of synergies there okay and then the extra shooting with the sixes to hit auto wound from Nurgle. Mm -hmm. uh, icon for bikes is oh. pretty nice. Bikes can take icon? Yeah. Like, They're one of the few units that can. <laughs> okay, cool. That's one of the big things is like Raptors can't take icons. If I, Raptors yeah. could take and icons, they can't, can't either. Yeah. Okay. But I like the mobility and I like the speed. And being able to make two things non-shootable that have a decent fire support um, is really cool. Um, awesome. So Legionnaires, bikes. Um, I like uh, flipping... Probably just like honestly, all kinds of units just work. A master, like a master apothecary, little 
Mass, Mass Possession is absolutely Oh yeah, his spells, his there. spells are so good. Now you yeah. won't have access to Relics and Warlord Traits, right? Because Bellacor is the Warlord? Um, I'm not quite sure off the bat. I think there's rules in there that say that you can still take Oh, those even ones. if Bellacor... I haven't that. looked at the army of Renown in a hot minute. Got it. Uh, but I don't even... The problem, biggest problem with the thing is I want to see when they when the app book actually drops that we get an FAQ saying that Bellacor can still take... You just add Bellacor to a Chaos Space Marine army, say it's army of Renown, can you still take Chaos Space Marine secondaries? Is like Bellacor like an agent in the Chaos situation? I see. Because the biggest thing is like they change the secondaries and that army will... <laughs> Probably just play with base secondaries, which is a little me. Okay, well, it'd be, uh, be interesting to see uh, if, if they're going to support for that. Yep. All right. Tool. I like Chosen also. They are cheap, durable, punchy dudes. All right. So speaking of Chosen, uh, are they going to step out in the line of sight of the Ultramarines? Probably so. Yeah? Just be bold. Yeah? Just don't you know they get to reroll hits and wounds against? Maybe. It's coming out? Maybe. That's what I want. I <laughs> That's what I want. <laughs> Could I torpedo? I could just torpedo this. If I did my prayer, I actually should have thought about the demon prince could have just gone like charged. Yeah, if you gave him an advance in charge. Yeah. <laughs> Auto six and eighteen. Come, he's stepping into golden range. Yep. I don't mind that. I may have a face gap. I would still like to, to get it started. <laughs> <laughs> He'll die in my turn. <laughs> um. So we got that. We're gonna still be sinking this file with this positioning mm -hmm. here. Yeah. So let's just go reserve. Let's resolve. Yeah, you've got three units on this flank that may want the to The Freeman Noise Marine, they're going to go to 12. Sure. Well, absolute no cares. Yeah, they're just given. really close. <laughs> um, Hi, friends. Yeah, that whole advanced no penalty thing, that's pretty that's good. pretty nice. Pretty good. All right. Bam. Um, let's advance the every unit. They're going to go 10. Mm -hmm. So they're all just, everyone should be, yeah, get 24 or 22. Or the big old herpy derp. Within 22? Yeah, so that's what I'm trying to say. Yeah. What, I think uh, one what hinges out. off of 22? Uh, then I get two, plus one damage against them. Oh, oh, you mean if you're within t oh, 10 inch yeah. move and then get within 12. Right. And then if you're within 12, you get plus one damage. Right. I understand now. Chosen. Mm -hmm. Go free. Nine. Um, I think that's okay. Okay. So. Chosen are stepping up a little bit. Yep. Very cool. Do Chosen come with an invuln built in? No. No invuln. All right. Burr, 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 burr. Mm -hmm. On the objective. Um, yeah. We can pop a CP, place a bomb with the unit that drops over there, which is cheeky. Bomb is what, three points at the end of the game? Uh, uh, four, four, I believe. Okay, that's nice. Mm -hmm. I think we're going to pop probably pop a CP on that. Very cool. You're going to make me do the action to come over and stop it? Yeah, I can place bomb and shoot, so. Yeah. Sounds, sounds cheeky and cool. Mm -hmm. So let's take this every unit noise rings. I like it. Ranging 10. All right, so now I have gotten what I asked for, and we will find out if I will soon regret it. <laughs> How much pain? Well, I did want you to, to step out where I could play with you. You sound a little strong, but all right. I, we're playing the game with Warhammer. <laughs> <laughs> Just putting dice up for when you disembark yeah, so that you've got the nines. Mm -hmm. All right. This Papa is... Carey's job is to hold or possession mm -hmm. and heal. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. When will you let Goleman go on a bloody rampage through your entire army? Oh, uh, I'm not sure yet. Okay. Just let me know when you're ready. Yep. Thank you. Okay. Demon Prince. Mm -hmm. It's going to go, I think, right here. Oh, hi. Okay. Pretty decent staging point. Yeah, it could be worse. Um, so, Mirror. Do, do, do. Making a pop, or not pop, uh, the apostle. master possession. Yeah. Excellent. Now that's by, uh, the apostle. Mm -hmm. We're going to go, uh, we're going to check here. We can pop the advance and charge next turn on any unit if we just pop two CP. Which is pretty tasty. It is. I don't mind you using your. And I can do that at any phase, so I can move into. I can be out of range of command phase and just move into it. Move yeah. into it. Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna set up for that. Okay. Um. So that's the, the most flexible apostle. flexible position is right here for this. Got it. Okay. Pretty good. Uh, bam. Um. If that's the case, then he just wants to move up to get character protection. Yep. That's the master of possession. Yep. Right there. Very cool. Yep. All right. I like it. 
I like it, Mark. Then these guys. All right, so 10 noise marines are in this pod, right? Yep, two okay. to five. All right, then you should, yeah, you should be able to get holy on my table side pretty easily with yeah. at least one of those noise marines. So, donk to here. Maybe this guy definitely goes here because that's Blastmaster. Yep. Please tell me these guys because you are over three, so I should mathematically be able to get two guys, I think. And that's the Blastmaster. That's a dead blast okay. master that's getting healed soon. Yes. What a guy. <laughs> yep. All right. So we should be able to get two guys on that squad right there. Okay. So two guys within are, are able to shoot the van vet. Yep. Okay. Then, bam. Might think here. Mm -hmm. We put other blast master right here to see downrange. Okay. So that's the second squad. Yep. All right. Their job is going to be to shoot the. Mm -hmm. Dudes, most likely. Yeah, those those voids at arms are probably gonna die soon, <laughs> if I were to guess. So then we're gonna put two of the mm -hmm. just hanging out around that that pod. It looks good to me. Yep, and then we're gonna take this front five man squad and at least put one there to make their okay. life harder. Looks like you are getting within nine of me now. Yeah, so I'm gonna shuffle it back, mm -hmm. shuffle it back. Okay. Here we go. Guns to be clear, out. it's the, the front of the dice, not the back. Yeah. It's, oh, yeah, you got it there. Perfect. Yep. Okay. Just shovel this pod back a little bit. Yeah, just give yourself a little breathing room. All, all right. right. So probably, and then they've also got the Tyrannic War veterans as an option yep. as well. Okay. All right. Psyche phase. Psyche phase. Let's see it. Let's try to bring back a dude. I really okay. thought that was a six. Ooh, I was I like, am I popping my CP here? Nope. I would have liked nope. it. <laughs> All right, so one, so now a Blastmaster comes back. So now a four-man yep. Noise Marine squad. These guys end up kidnapping his, their Blastmaster, so oh. that's there. Yeah, and so. then this one goes here. All right, so not an extra body down, but both units advance, so he'll still be taking that limit. Not penalty. Doesn't take penalty. <laughs> it's just limit I can't charge. Okay. And then we're going to Light Flag and he's the Chosen. Okay. Oh, uh, Mark. Oh, there it is! Oh, uh, uh, yeah, just no. And he's got <laughs> two it. wounds left? Oh, my uh, he goodness. He healed one. So, oh, no, if he has three left, sorry. Three left. Okay, okay. still, that's count. that's a risk. Uh, I'm re-rolling it. Yep. Not risking uh, it. Okay, goes Okay. Off. So then, now the life is on the, uh, yes, the chosen. chosen. Okay. And then we're going to give them, uh, I think, plus one toughness. This man's still casting spells? You think you've got a snake, guys? Okay. Okay. This is a so, five, probably not. Probably not, I don't okay. think so. All right. I had the pluses to cast, yes, but I just didn't want to sacrifice any bodies there. Yeah. I probably actually should. I could take a noise ring, because there's the only reason I only shooting here. I will just do that, because there's no reason not to. So you do three mortal wounds. Yes. Okay. Marker. Sweet. Like I, every every it dead noise ring, that. every dead noise ring makes me happy, Mark. I yes. just want you to know that. All right, and then over here, we're going to warp time this unit. Okay. Nine. Field six. All right, so they're going to move six inches. Yep. The okay. no recover here would have been really nice. And put Obstic on the subjective. Oh, because they're troops and Emperor's children. Of course yep. they are. What absolute fun lads. Chads. Lads. Chads. We're going to kill them. Uh, we do not want the Blastmaster there. We want the Blastmaster over here. <laughs> okay. Then let's think. We got options there. Looks good. All right, I'm um, definitely going to get shot here. We'll see how bad it hurts. Yep. So they're just going to be right on the edge there. We <laughs> want the real ones. I'm ready for it. I'm ready for it, Mark. All right. You know my armor is contempt for, contempt. for you, right? And for all of your heritage. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's go ahead and do some shooting. Yes, I am I'm ready for this. This is the save making phase. We're going to go ahead and take the unit that has two guys that can limit here. Okay. Bam. We're going to put the ever small arms right here. Okay. So two little guys here, two little guys here. Yep. And then there's a big guy who has Big guy yet. has options. Probably so does. So the question is, where does the option? Should I try to come that thing? Mm -hmm. um, or do I try to just kill some Marines? I think we're going to go after some band vets. Um, we got 18. Because that thing brackets at what, like five? When it has five left, it'll be brackets. Yeah. I think we're just going to put the high volume shots on the okay. Marines. It's so AP2. Uh, sixes are better, so it's you're at least taking three ups. Yeah. Okay. And I'm reeling so one. Three guys here, two guys there. Yeah. Looks good. So two guys on the voids. They'll be fine. Two sixes. Oh, jeez. Well, you could miss to make up for that. There we go. Uh, AP two. Okay. 
These are AP1? Yep. Uh, fails one of those, so I've lost two models, and I'll lose a third model. Nice. Uh, and these can't advance and charge? No. They can shoot so These guys still. can shoot. Yeah, but we'll just pull that so that this squad doesn't have as many targets. Oh, cool. Because, uh, yeah, they're not going to have too many choices. Um, All right. Song of Blasters here. Yes. Three old ones. Demon Prince okay. so exploding. Back to even. And then fours. Fours. Why, Mark? Um, these are AP two. two. And those these are, are AP, AP ones, and these are all two damage. Okay, so let's take the uh, the two big ones. These are in cover. Yep. Um, fill two. one, and then three small ones. We're good. Okay. And then the big blastmaster. Yes. Actually, I forgot the devastator. Today. I'm just putting that there. <laughs> oh, <laughs> this. Dumb. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you got it. He, yeah. He's got it. Okay. I forgot that one was like the only That's one fine. I could shoot. Can the everyone see him if the gun was twisted? I just come for it. Close um, with my hand. No, I don't think so. This okay. guy barely has a, a shoulder pad. Got it. All here. Okay. But no explosions. Uh, I'll no take explosions. It. What's the strength and damage on these? AP strength five, AP two. AP two. What's the two damage? damage? Oh, even if it's not a half range? It should be at, right at 18. Of the Devastators? Yeah. I'm sure. Oh, doing the pre-measuring, I should have one. No, it's okay. 23. No, I could, okay, never mind. Okay. <laughs> it is here, Vin. Yeah. That's yeah, yeah, why yeah. I wasn't doing it. That's math. I'm bad. Okay. I was like, so, dude. 5 AP2. AP2. Okay. I don't want to pull the sergeant yet, so we'll just take it on. Um, uh, oh, we'll... It's not two damage. Yeah, I know. So I'm just going to allocate it here because I just need dual movements. Okay, so, yeah. so it is just, here. It's going back to the original okay, game plan. That's okay, why that's fine. I originally talked about in the movement phase. I'm looking at this one. I'm yeah, realizing okay. I can't do it. So I'm like, right, so this is. Five AP two two damage now. Yes. So they'll be taking three up saves and cover. Yep. Yeah. Three guys at a time. Um. Yeah. That kind of sucks. These guys haven't shot yet. This back unit. What can they actually see? Oh, uh, the back unit. I can see down here. They got one guy to here, and then the three yeah. guy, and yep. then three guys right here have like there. <laughs> okay. So me pulling Vanvitz doesn't change anything because this yeah. guy can see out of the line. Yeah. So we'll take in cover. Uh, we'll lose do. one. Lose two. Jack. One, two. All right. And then we're going to shoot the next squad. Mm -hmm. Um, We're going to sink. I think just put the Blast Master right here. Confirm that kill. Okay. Um, Take away those CC threats. Mm -hmm. Then yes, we're going to pop off the rest of the small arms. Ain't got crazy options. Yeah. So I just think we're going to wait on that squad. We're going to wait for that squad. Okay, cool. We're going to go ahead and take this unit and just shoot both of these homes there. Blastmasters inside okay. 18, but over 18. I think one guy's just outside 12. Looks good. So I got been six guys uh, at two damage range. Looks good. No rerolls. Exploding sixes. Very cool. Looks like one, two, two, three, in. three in. Nice. All right. Tough fours. Score. Yep. Sixes are spicy. All right. While Mark's rolling that, we got a five dollar super chat from oh, Cosmic Three yeah. D Net. He says, "Hashtag Team Perry. We know Let's John go. has oh. no chance. No chance. See about these armor saves. Oh, the, two the, guys. Uh, AP one. one. Those ones. Yeah. yeah, these are the AP ones. Two uh, guys. Apothecary. Wounded." Uh, kills one model, yep. and then these are AP um, two, so three ups. Good. So one guy dies, four plus, he's shooting. Boop. We're just going to put uh, two bulk gun shots into this unit has not shot. Nope. So you're going right there. Oh, okay. All right. Threes. Sweet. Fours. Uh, one AP three. Okay. One's good. And then the Blastmaster. The guy we least care about is right here. Okay. No rerolls, but one exploding. Mm -hmm. Threes. Two wounds, AP2. AP2. Uh, so these are uh, three ups in cover. Yep. Uh, one guy dies, two damage. He does die. Yep. Four plus pop. He does not pop. Okay. All right. Slowly but surely, mm -hmm. grinding for the Marines. Um, haven't took any wounds there. Then the question is do we shoot eradicators or these guys? I think. Uh, 12 in primary mark. So well, what? actually, it would be an 8. You've already probably taken that one. Yeah, I've already taken this one. Yep. 
Still, I want an eight on primary. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yes. No. Yes, Mark. Okay. <laughs> Give it to me. So let's think here. Um, we got this other unit of noise rings. I think they're just going to put their blast master. Um, try and go for van vets. Try to confirm that van vets. Put okay. all the small arms right up here. Okay. Just see if we can plink a couple dudes off. 100%. So um, this is the second small? Yeah. Got it. So on the van vets, real ones. Okay. Three hits. Three hits. Uh, one AP3, two AP2s. Okay, nice. So you got one guy in cover. Yep. Um, so we'll take the AP2s first. Yep. Uh, so three up. Oh, dead. sad. He's dead. Uh, next guy dead. is dead. Yep, so that's dead. Okay. Oh, sadness. All right, so that's one kill and shooting for yep. your uh, uh, set. No, one kill and shooting. Yep, because I haven't killed them yet. Yep. Here's small arms. Real ones. Mm -hmm. Two sixes, so leave two of those twos in. Okay. Fours. I'll take them. Casual fours. These are AP two. Sure, why not? Well, that's silly. All right, here's um, two ups. Okay, one ones. guy is taking damage. He's dead. And that's then... only one damage at this range. Oh, okay. So I, I failed one. Okay. And then um, these are uh, AP two, so these yep. are three ups. So I take one more. I do take it. So Does he pop? Yes. He's going to shoot the same squad. Yep. Because this they haven't shot yet. Yep. So we'll see if we can get a guy up. Threes. Gulliman. Okay. <laughs> this is not meant to be. If I roll four <laughs> ones, they will not hit. <laughs> That's what we learned today. All right. They're wounded now, so I think I got to shoot them. Mm -hmm. Um, The van bits are gone. That's really big. Mm -hmm. Um, We got four dudes going into the Devastators. Mm-hmm. And I think we're going to put four dudes into that squad yep. there. So Blastmaster is located where? Right here. But we'll just go on to the Devastators. Sure. So none of them are wounded yet. Correct. Let's just go on down. Real ones. Real ones. <laughs> ah, out of the box. One and six. Oh, okay. All right. Donka. Five. These are AP threes. Yep. And these are AP two. Yep. All right, this is the Blastmaster. Okay, yep. so we'll do an AP uh, three uh, fails. Uh, I guess the Blastmaster, I'm not. I don't think you have cover because it's right here. Yeah, yeah, so that's yeah. the Blastmaster. Yeah, so he's definitely dead. Um, I'm looking at the next line and how many do. He'll get cover from these guys. So we'll, um, we'll take the Melty Melty now. Uh, so he's dead, so point point. And then uh, the next yeah, guy in line. Okay, no one's making saves, that's bad. Um, <laughs> Like make one of those, and then here's two normal ones. These I should have cover from. Yeah, plus one minus one, so you should be good. So we're good there. Yep, it's AP two. Yep. Armor can temper stack that. All right, so I've got two grav. Uh, neither shooting and a melta shooting. Um, this this happens after your uh, resolve. You resolve everything. Sorry. So go right ahead, and then I'll shoot All the right. melta. Into <clears throat> the grabs are what I really want to be shooting. Real there. ones. Sixes. AP two on the sixes. Nice. Okay, two ups. Yep. Okay, three ups. Bonk. Bonk. Uh, that's getting a CP, honestly. I want to keep one heavy weapon alive here. Yeah. Uh, fails. So I guess it's a guy in cover. Um, what hasn't shot yet? Oh, that entire flank. Yeah, so they're not shooting the Devastators. No. Okay, so we'll leave that. And then one, two, three, four. So now the multi multi shoots. He'll just shoot here. Yep. Put up my shots for the next half that unit. Uh, one hit. I'm not in Goldman range. Uh, one AP4. Where at? Oh, uh, I think I don't have a ton of options. Yeah. I think a five makes it because Armor Contempt. Armor Contempt uh, in cover. Let me see. Yeah, Melta was at the back, right? Um... Oh, this guy wasn't shooting me anyway. Oh, the, it was the Melta. Oh, yeah. so we're yeah. going to shoot this squad then. Because yeah. I, I don't want to shoot cover. I, you okay. can reroll the save if you want. Gotcha. No, cover. it's fine. Okay. okay. All right. Oh, uh, no. I can, that's the back one, this front unit. I'll just take a dude. Okay. On my skies. Uh, I'll roll damage for you. Take a dude. Yep. Take a dude. <laughs> yeah. Bonk. And then mm. uh, 12 more shots from here to here. Yep. Real ones. No sixes, sixes. but pretty good. And these are within 12, so they are plus one damage. Yep. Got it. Sixes are AP uh, good. Um, right. Sixes are AP good. Yikes. Yep. Uh, two ups. Good. 
Three ups. Uh, fail one. Sixes. Okay, wounds the guy. Nice. None of them can actually see this guy. And they've already I can shot? see a bunch of this guy. Yeah, oh, yeah, I know, I know. I'm just... You're, you're shooting somewhere. Yeah. Uh, I'm just debating. Yep. He's getting the wound. The five-man squad over there... Yep. ...is just going to go ahead and pump all their shots in that. Two mammoths left. They're going to be fine. Um, I think we're going to pop the mortals, possibly. Okay. Because we really just need that dead. <laughs> no, Mark. That's big. <laughs> <laughs> Let them live. Their leadership, very brave. Yep. Small arms, Vin. This may be a mistake, but I'm also just trying to be on the lines of caution. Mm -hmm. Sixes are cool. Sure. Two sixes. And then uh, sixes would be really spicy. One mortal wound to kill that one dude. Um, okay. And then uh, this is AP2. Okay. So these are AP2, AP1? Yep. Okay, so AP1s. These are damage one or two? One. Because I don't think I have any guys in tall. Okay. So they're all good? Um, actually, I'll check. Well, I made them anyway, so yeah, yeah, you're good. Uh, AP two, three up, uh, good. Okay. And was that the entire unit's activation? Yes. Okay. So then a six. Oh up. no, I gotta, I gotta do. Uh, the blastmaster. Blastmaster. Okay, go ahead. One six. Nice. Six threes. Two mortal wounds. Okay, so three mortal wounds total. So it'll just. Kill so that will kill them no matter what. Yes. Yeah, so then we can stop here. Oh, you got, you got pop carry actually. Oh, I do. I okay. That's. Uh, so you got two at AP three. Okay, so these are three ups, four ups. Yes. Okay, snake guys, they're dead. <laughs> yeah. Damage too. Yeah. Magic apothecary, not that magic. All right, both guys die. Uh, they'll both shoot on death. Yep. Him first. Nope, him. Yes. So are both two because four ups. Yes. All right. Um, try to pull out a dude still. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to do here first. Just try to get a, a guy. Uh, two AP uh, three on that squad, so you get cover. Cover. So we'll kill the wounded man. Kill wounded. And then the second guy will shoot at the next squad that has a wounded guy because they want yep. to kill models. Go him and save me. One, two. Uh, one AP3. So that'll kill the wounded guy there. Yep. Yay. All right. All right. The next squad of noise rings. And that's your second kill in shooting. Yep. Awesome. Oh, I totally forgot about these guys here. So I'm obsec. I'm yeah, you do outnumber me on the objective. And I can possibly charge you with yeah, these you units. Can, you can call charger. So, uh, yeah. We got here. Oh, yeah, I assumed dead. you were just saving them for later or later kills. Yeah. I think I'm going to put the Blastmaster down range. Okay, uh, that'll probably get Oh, uh, And then the rest of them are just shooting here. Shooting there? Sweet. On a reds. They'll be fine. Tempting to just go kill the Eradicators. But I think um, it's better just to go ahead and confirm the kill because that's Try someone. The points. That's someone next turn that can't raise a banner. Yes, that is true. So uh, high volume, two sixes. Mm -hmm. and so this is the blastmaster into the yeah into the dudes. AP two. Mm, does sad. that just kill them? Uh, they, get, they get a six up. They get a six up. However, that does kill them. So that's a third unit dead to shooting. Yep. Which uh, that will probably be tough, tough, tough to match. I think I could have gotten two, but three is going to be pretty difficult. Yeah. No explode, or one explode, but no rerolls. Mm -hmm. Well, fives. Two wounds. This is AP2, AP1. And these are and damage two, two. Two. Okay, so we're at the damage two stage. Yep. So, oops. So we're going to put it on the back guy. Yep. Who's in cover. AP. I have an apothecary. There's nothing. Uh, he wants to heal the devs. Okay, so we'll just uh, AP uh, one goes to a two up and then a three up. Fails that two damage, six up, feel no pain. All right, so the the back uh, eradicator is wounded. Yep. But we have an apothecary, so that's going to go away in a second. Yep. All right. Then you got leaderships for the devastator. Um, he's lead seven, goes to lead eight. Lost he's four, fail on five, six. Lost four, fails on a five or six. I am not close enough to the ancient. That was silly on my part. Um, I could spend two CP to auto pass because I just want to have him, and I have so many CP that honestly, we're just going to pass that so yeah i just i don't want to lose him and be silly because yeah. he's going to be two heavy weapons and then a cherub so that'll actually be a not unreasonable amount of firepower yep okie dokie well, you get a primary for four four primary you do get you that get one banner yep one point on banners uh i've killed three things in shooting but none in combat none in combat so far maybe um, i'll come maybe i'll come give you some options then uh, let's think what else banners that assassinate we're working on Sounds good. Eventually, the idea is there's just no characters left. <laughs> <laughs> All right, back to me. Yeah. Six command points. I got a one. Primary. 
that's the uh, that's an objective I can very easily take over by shooting you. Um, so um, let's just explore our options here. So this is ten chosen, four guys, five guys. Nine chosen. Nine chosen. Four guys, five guys. Okay. Chosen have all the buff spells on them. So they. Oh, it's right, because you did plus two to cast, so they yeah. all, all three yeah. of them passed. So we're probably ignoring Chosen for a little bit here, um, and working on easy-to-kill Marines. That sounds better. And this is now one, two, three. That's now six guys, because two of them are dead. Yep. Okay. Six, yeah, because you killed one. Yeah, because I'm honestly thinking that what I'm going to try for is Eradicators are going to step out here, Grabs are going to step out here. We're going to try to kill a couple models from that unit, and then this Eradicator squad is going to remove your buffs. I don't like you having buffs. <laughs> I'm, I'm done with this. <laughs> Too many buffs. Too many buffs. Too many buffs. <laughs> All right. That looks like a thing I can do. Excellent. Are you staying in tactical doctrine? Oh, yeah. I, I, I'm 100% <laughs> am. Yeah, we're not. What a question. <laughs> um, I will struggle to deal with all of this. There's a lot to deal with. Um, these absolutely fine gentlemen. How are how are the chosen in combat? Just real quick. Strength what? five, four attacks, AC six. Do they get plus one to wound anyway? Oh, uh, you got vets. Two CP. Yeah. One yeah, damage. one damage. I'm at one. I'm looking at that that sweet universe where Gulliman just like walks into them. I'm just kind of figuring out how long that's gonna take for yeah. both of us. I'm not really sure in either direction how long that takes. Right. Uh, but I do think that this is the way Gulliman wants to go. Yeah, Goldman wants to start collecting heads, if I'm be honest. <clears throat> Goldman! You know, you can't just take Goldman and then not use him, right? That would just be... That wouldn't be Big cool. That would, that would be pretty sad. Um, this fine fellow well, is going to move two up, four over. He's not going to get quite there, but an apothecary will be able to res him, even if we roll a one on that advance. So the apothecary is going to head over that way yep. and give you your first assassinate point. Yay! Yeah. Go get him, buddy. Uh, they have a cherub still. We're going to... Uh, if you can just find a graph can, there he is. If you can just grab a graph can for me. We know exactly what this guy's doing. Shoot! Boink. I just want both graph cannons to have options down there. Yep. Um, then the captain is going to move... That's a decent amount of marines, actually. Oh. Yeah, you, you got more than I wanted to. Three. I'm just trying to think for my own practice and math where I'm at. Mm-hmm. It's like I haven't done as insane amount of uh, map on work for the army. Okay. <clears throat> These eradicators yeah. are um, just stepping forward. They're not healing, hilariously. No, they're they're actually not. <laughs> just, <laughs> they're just gonna take it. <laughs> yeah, no, they just are. It's just gonna happen. Uh, then the van vets are gonna come forward. Yep. Oh, uh, there's an ancient. Oh, let's advance that ancient to see where he goes. Play okay. options. Plenty of options, yeah. He's going to go two and two. Oh, he's plus one because of uh, Goldman, so six left. Whee! Screen! Yep. <laughs> um, Stay away. These eradicators are walking out five to right here. Yep. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I think they're actually going to need to go down there to work on that problem. Yeah. Because there's, I need to just solve some of this. Uh, of these, there's three noise marines in cover, it looks like. Yes. How many of those are from where? Like, what's, what's one the... from the front squad, two from the two back. from the back squad. Okay, so there's a little bit of cover from everywhere. All right, so the eradicators are going to step out this way because I actually really want those Goldman buffs. I think, um, so they'll they'll stick this way instead of pushing up and not having any buffs. So I can only give one unit the rear ones to hit yeah. at a time. All right, uh, these Terran Corps veterans are going to go touch the objective. <clears throat> with their sweet AP3 guns. We're going to see how well they rapid fire. Boink. The marine <clears throat> grind. The marine grind has to happen. It's like 5th edition. Yep. Back to my childhood. We are, we are right back to the marine grind. Uh, we got a $5 super chat from King Hef. He says, Ooh. Mr. Mark Perry. Hi, pipe, pipe. What's up? Hi, pipe, indeed. Flip table. No. Wait, not that. I built it. I can flip it. Please don't. <laughs> um, this storm speeder is going to step right up here. Um, it just wants to have... Shot options yep. into a couple of things. So it should be able to shoot down this line if it needs to. Should be able to shoot down that line. Actually, it's 16 inches. I might just go down this way so that I have uh, the ability to shoot at uh, down that line at your characters and those noise marines if I need to do damage. Yeah. And I can still shoot everything over here. 
16 inches. We Did I pop the CP? Yeah, I popped the CP to place a bomb, correct? To what? Did I place the bomb? Oh, you didn't actually place it, but you did spend the command point. I did spend the command point. Okay, cool. Yeah. One bomb placed. I'm going to just place it right here. Yeah, that's I'll have to deal with that. All right. I was like wondering, I'm like, I feel like I'm missing a CP. Ah, yes. Um, <laughs> so he he went, so the banner moved up with an advanced roll, which yep. only makes sense if I'm charging you. It has to be what? On your table half period. Yeah. 30 inches. Yeah, be, you can put it 30.1. Yeah. I'm going to place it right here with this model. Therefore, I can easily um, walk away and have options more for, for everybody. So. Yeah, I think we are going to send bandits in there. Oh, I don't think I'm going to be able to put enough shooting in that they just disappear because I want to put it in other places. Right. So we're going to trust that one to combat. We'll see how it works. All righty. Um, actually, I'm going to spend a command point then to put them in assault after. I have oh. to do that command phase. I apologize, but we're going to good, do buddy. it now. All right. Your CP regen? No. No. Oh. I just have Go I saw Goleman just did that. No, no. His Warlord trade is actually terrible. Got so it. I, didn't, I didn't pay for it. His Warlord <laughs> trade is garbage. All right. But we're going to shoot you many times now. Uh, we're going to start with the, the fun stuff, which is simply Tyrannic War Veterans. Yep. No one is wounded. How many of them have... Are they shooting here? Are they... They're going here. Do they all have rapid fire? Yeah, yeah rapid fire is 24. I'm stationary, buddy. Oh, yeah, your space marines. Ultra marines. <laughs> ultra marines. <laughs> ultra marines. Um, the squad that has one dude. You had a homelander like voice in that second. Ah. <laughs> and I'm like, oh no. I'm an ultra marine. I can do whatever I want. <laughs> uh, we're gonna shoot the guy that has one cover. Yeah. Because that seems better. Uh, so these would be AP three. So you'll still get a point. Okay? But we're gonna work on it. Um, little sad hits. All right. Fours. Uh, there we go. One, two, three, four. four. AP is three. So this is on the, the squad. Guy. Squad with one in cover. I don't know which one that is, but the squad yeah. with one in cover is the one I want. Yeah. So cover guy. Cover guy. If he likes cover it, guy. he likes Six. it a little bit too much for me. All right. Whoop. Thank you. Um, so let's start shooting down this way. Yep. So um, we're going to spend one command point, and the grab squad is going to reroll ones to hit. Gotcha. And they're almost certainly going to pop a chair, but they're going to go straight into that squad there. Gotcha. Minus one to hit. Yep. Um, your is heavy. Uh, stationary, friend. But you still minus one because of forest. <laughs> yes. Uh, three's the wound. Yep. Uh, looks like five. Five. AP three. AP three. That would have been a good thing to put in depth doctor, but I didn't want to spend two CP. Um, Kills. Kill four. Four. AP three in armor of contempt and then cover, so it yep. kills four. So it's kills left. four. Yep. Um. Oh, so I can just shoot your characters now. Yep. Oh, Mark. <laughs> what you gonna do? I'm gonna shoot your characters. All right. <laughs> Um, <clears throat> yeah, that's there, no, no, not a moment of hesitation. Uh, I can still see that guy, so we'll, we'll pop the cherub and we'll just. I don't really care about them. Uh, so that's the sergeant and a dude or yeah, blastmaster. blastmaster. Oh no, screw that. That's good value. <laughs> um, that's that's a that's a load up right there. That's really scary. Yeah. Combat is not going to solve this by itself. Yeah. Uh, I'll be hitting you on twos. Power fist is. We'll put the grab here because it's hitting on threes. Okay. I think I've done enough. Uh, matters. <laughs> And then threes, uh, three more uh, AP threes on that front squad. Gets one of them. One? All right. So it's I not six man. this guy. Yes. Okay. Just trying to thin that out. All right. So they're gone. Chair popped. Uh, the bite captain is going to shoot at your dark apostle. Yep. Do you have a rule where you have to allocate wounds to the, the little friends? Anything like that? Yeah. I don't have to allocate to them. I don't see grass about Do you? Okay. Okay. Yeah. Well, that's where we're going. <laughs> yep. If that's the case, I didn't know about that. Blastmasters is a little farther back, and this guy's just on the objective, just as insurance. Um, I'm gonna see if that's possible. Because he shot there. Yeah. Let's see. Eh. No. I'm gonna just say no, have it. Oh, okay, cool. Okay. All right. Well, we're gonna shoot there. Yep. Here is his uh, combi bolter off the bike. Gotcha. Threes because of the forest into the Dark Apostle. Yep. But I'm rerolling ones because of Gulliman. Absolutely iconic. <laughs> so many twos. Um. Uh, nope, because they're toughness four. Wow, that was terrible. All right, here's the relic gun. This one needs to do better. Okay, rerolling ones, much better. Rerolling wounds as well. These are AP one, and uh, which doesn't really matter for you. Real wounds is important. Screw that. I want more. No Sir, mortals. You got one. I did not get a mortal. One. How is this possible? We're good. Okay. Oh my God. How, what even happened there? <laughs> Fine, I will continue <laughs> to shoot you. Gulliman is shooting them. Okay. Um, shooting the Marines? No, no, I'm shooting the... Apostle? This, yeah, that's stupid okay. idiot. Threes. Um, there we go. So that still fails. 
yep. threes, three. Um, these are AP. Do the, what's the save on the disciples? Four up and down. The disciples? The yeah. whole model has a four. The whole unit? Jeez. Yeah. All right. Fair enough. Take it on the middle one. Dead. Okay. Because so if be that clear, guy dies, I can just apothecary reason back. Yeah, don't. Don't worry about that, buddy. <laughs> we ain't done here. <laughs> Eradicators! <laughs> so, no, never raise character? Okay. That's good. All right, good. Uh, well, someone's dying to coherency then. Yep. Um, wow, this is insanely Hilarious. annoying. This, this guy, what the heck was that? He had like an entire job of literally do anything, and he chose not to. Um, oh, this is terrible. Cow sons? Yeah, so these eradicators aren't interacting with this half of the board, so we don't actually really have to worry about that. Yep. Um, I think, how are these squads broken up? Is this like a front and the back? Yeah, front, back. Okay, we're going to just shoot the back squad, I think, with the eradicator. Okay. Uh, so this squad is going into the back squad. Gotcha. My so, one. Yep, yeah, it'll be fours, but we'll have four rerolls from Gully. Um, yep. So this will be the, the heavy melt rifles first. You're not getting out of it. Range, I'm just doing Yeah, it. yeah, go ahead. Yep. Uh, try again. Here we go. Two zero and ones. Try that again. Uh, so one, two, three, four at AP four. Sorry. Four at AP four. Yep. So these will be five ups. Five ups. Or death. We'll kill two. Two. And then the multi melta. Yep. And this is in the five man, correct? Uh, whichever one is not directly in front of Gulliman. Yeah. I want Gulliman to charge them. Gotcha. Marvelous. Okay. Okay, three hits. Twos. Okay, three more saves. Same math. Yep. Lose yep. The dude. And, uh, yes, you do lose the dude. Okay. Yep. All right, that was, again, much less effective than I expected. Um, how do I get a save mark? I don't, I don't want that. One more oh. kit. Yep. All you, uh... right, we got a $5 super hey. chat from yes. Apollo Chang. It goes, Joe! are you ready? It goes, no, we just lost the sexiest orc player to chaos. <laughs> Yeah, why would you why would you break his heart like that? Because I am in a I'm in an abusive relationship with chaos. Ain't this is my group. OG faction. <laughs> okay. So I think we're gonna so shot shot. So I basically have left an eradicator, eradicator unit and the two, two uh two storm feeders. Um these characters being alive is really not what I want. Um yeah. so I don't know how we're gonna do the eradicators on this one, but we're probably gonna just do the storm speeder first, and he's just gonna dump everything into this guy. He, what's his invul? The master possession five of Five? Which which one is shooting him? Storm Seater? Can you see him right now? Oh, I thought he, he could. He straight up can. You have oh, to okay. Oh. if you want to. Because remember, you edged out a little bit. You moved it. Yeah, yeah, I can see him. If yeah, you I want was... to change your movement, I just okay, yeah. so you can be on the objective. And do it. This is about how far I can get. So if I can't see him, I can't see him. Yeah, you can't see him there. All right, well, in that case, he's going to shoot the stupid apostle. Yeah. Although you're going to lose a dude to... No, I just want you to lose. <laughs> just want him to die. Yeah, uh, and he'll dump his, um, his missiles into the... Uh, yeah. The squad in front, because they're only 24-inch range. Yeah. The four-man? Uh, or the this, two-man? The small one that's not getting charged by Gullman. Because okay. I can't tell what squad is what. Gotcha. Uh, so here's the little rockets on the squad not being charged by Gullman. Three shots. Threes rolling ones. Love this. Love that. Um, okay. Here's the <laughs> missiles on the back squad. These toughness on this guy? On which unit? The possum? Oh, the only four. Okay. Still then these all go at the same time, because it's... Because they ignore the little dudes. Yeah. All right. Um, one, two, three. Twos, one, two, three. These will all be invulns. Four up. Are they all a four up invuln? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so then who is that on? That's that on the little guy. All right, so he's dead. Then, um, uh, and he fails two. Okay, so 2d6 Boop. damage on him. Yep. First one, two. two. Second one, five. Kills. All right, so Apostle dead. Yep. All right, dare I shoot an entire eradicator squad of this master of possession? Dare? <laughs> I think I am that guy, Mark. Let's we'll just make sure I've got my 24 inch range. It looks like my line of sight's pretty clean. Yeah, your line of sight's pretty clean. You got, definitely got the minus one. Can you hold that up at the edge of his base? Yeah, you got it. That is my unit. Excellent. Yeah. Oh, that, that urge to split fire. What is his interval? Five up. He's a five up interval. Yep. And you have one CP. Yep. I mean, the smart thing is to just cast death on him. Yeah. For sure. So we're just going to do that. Okay. I don't like this guy being alive. <laughs> Here's the multi melta. I just, yeah. One, two, three, four. Two, zero, roll in ones. Four end balls. <clears throat> like, roll that damage. You only have three wounds left. Okay, he's got one wound left. Okay, he's dead. 
Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Let's get this man out of here. Okay. All right. Um, so now this storm speeder is basically the last thing left. Yeah. Got um, some options, but weird options. Yeah, we're going to dump everything on this squad that has um, the one guy in cover yeah. wounded. Here's the three big shots first. Uh, one, two, three. And one, two, AP three. Three goes to force? Yep, so. Kills him. All right, and then here's the 2d3. Yep. And three shots. Two, one, two, three. Oh, how are he even shooting him here? Because this room blocks. How can I not shoot him? Yeah. Oh, I guess that was a different guy. Um, Sorry, I thought I was shooting there. Yeah, you're good. If you want to. Yeah, is it wiggling like literally an inch? I think so. That like, wasn't, that uh, it's, like, it's like a few inches. Is that, is that over him? Yeah, I say you got it there. Okay, perfect. All right, I'll take that. All right. Um, did I roll my wounds yet for the missiles? No. Okay. So it was three hits, I think. And one. Oh, sad. One save. All right, he's fine. Okay. So not so good. Oh, what you got for me, Charlie? Charles! Oh, man. We got a couple super chats uh, mm -hmm. while you guys are transitioning phases Excellent. here. First one is a $5 super chat from hey. Cultus Chan C. Says, hi, Art of War. Feels like, feels on the triumph now. Does it feel good for, um, what's that say, Jack? LOF? Feels good for Leap of Faith. Leap of Faith. Ah, uh, the Triumph of Catherine is actually decent now. It, it went down 20 points, which really helps. Um, it does help out the secondary game since you're taking a leap of faith basically every time. Yeah. Uh, it just gives you five more miracle dice and it lets them be a lot easier to spend. I actually don't mind the triumph. I think that she's going to be one of those units that's difficult to fit in the list because she is 200 points. But if uh, you she's are like a mastery level, like if you have full complete mastery and practice with it, mm -hmm. you can really lean everything into it. Right? Yeah, she doesn't do nearly as much as you remember though. Yeah, you haven't played, just, you haven't I, played, I haven't played her in this codex. I'm, yeah. I'm so used to her last. Think codex. about half the miracle dice and half the rules from last time, but she's okay. worse in combat now. Um. Don't worry, she is more expensive now. Uh, no, she, she's actually not bad, though. She was just amazing before. Yeah. Um, she I think she's, if you like really like the model, if you want to get it in, I think she's actually good enough to include in the list now. Yep. Mm -hmm. uh, it says, um, also, Chaos Space Marines feels like it lacks good target for all the core rerolls, considering Plague Marines, I guess. Considering core rerolls for, like, which type of rerolls? Because there's lots of different rerolls. Yeah. I'm getting rerolled a lot into right now. I don't know why. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I don't know Mark's been rerolling some dice against me. If you tell gonna, me those Marines aren't core, though, I'll... I'm gonna, let, I'm gonna let Jack look at that for a second. We have sure, another okay. super chat from ID hey. Dodds uh, hey, for two dollars. He says, "What would John put in his sister's list roughly after the new Nephilim changes?" Oh, tanks. so uh, as a matter of fact, um, uh, the sister's list that I played at Charity Hammer this past weekend it was with the new Nephilim changes. So I think it's absolutely, I think it's very strong. Uh, and as a matter of fact, I think Jack is going to be playing that game, that list in the war room tomorrow. But it's uh, basically a Bloody Rose good stuff list with. Morven Vol, uh, a, a good tool of Candace, uh, two 10 strong Rectibuter squads, three uh, uh, jump girl units. You've got two Zephyrim, a Seraphim, a Castigator, a Rhino, eight Repentia, eight Repentia, five Repentia, and then three characters to support that, which is the uh, Hospitaller, the Dogmata, and the Repentia Spear. And that list Oops. has been crazy fun to play. I played it again this weekend at Charity Hammer, so uh, make sure. You actually, we uh, restreamed it, so you can check out those games on our YouTube channel below or the Best in Tabletop. Uh, Stream as well. All right, so I'm basically done shooting you. Um, I'm just sad about the captain, honestly. Like I just like <laughs> what, so excited what was for that? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Reroll re wounds. Let's put one save down. Twelve yep. shots. That's great. All right. Um, everyone shots. We're gonna charge you now. Yep. Um, we're gonna charge these devastators in. Okay. Uh, while he's doing. Tempting the Overwatch here. I know. But yep. Now if I had everyone in the ruin, I probably would. But since I don't have defensible up, I won't do it. Uh huh. Uh, clarification on that champ uh, question. He wanted to um, ask what the targets you would use for like uh, Abaddon's chapter master would be. Like, what's what are some strong targets Chaos would want to use those? I so I'm working on some Black Legion soupy crazy stuff. But maybe on the channel a lot, or maybe at an event coming up soon. I think like you have so many different options. I really like bikers. Nurgle bikers. I think it's six to hit auto wounds with them, and you can pop cloud of flies on the bike unit now. So you can just move around. This is mobile. Just reroll all that stuff. You can put them in a different legion in the turn. Doesn't really matter for that once per game. Give like, them make ignore cover with iron warriors. Iron cover, ignore cover, and no reroll wounds on top of the transhuman hit rolls and hit reroll hits or wounds. Yeah, yeah. I mean, um, that's good. So like everyone. the the super flex there, 
for that biker unit. Also, still have chain swords. You know, it can. Mm -hmm. It's a really good versatile unit. Noise Marines. It's really crazy with. Um, what was trust there say? The just practically almost any unit. I think, in my opinion, I also like it on Black Legion Rubik Marines with the mm -hmm. Flamers. Because nice. you can just come out, come out, drop pod, flame some stuff later, walk in, the, walk into that range and just cook or just torpedo. Because they can also just cast warp time on themselves. Mm -hmm. That's a you know, I can't remember if they're five inch movement based on rubrics. It's an 11, 12 inch movement of cook plus a d6. So it's pretty strong. With real wounds with the flamers and since they're chaos space marines, they get plus two shots. So their flamers are not just d6 shots, d6 plus two with the rubric marine flamers. That's really good. All right. Well, let's do it. These devastators are going in. Whee! Eight inches. Also, mm -hmm. dual raptor units with Harkin and uh, what's his face? Oh, yeah, raptor cool. and Yeah. Thank you guys for cool. the super chats. Yes. Thanks. Go right there, face that guy. <laughs> yep. The van vets are gonna charge. Yep. Plus one. Seven probably still that? makes it. Maybe seven is like that. Definitely that measure spot. Looks like you're within eight. Okay. Yeah, eight's right there. So there we go. So boink. Yep. You can. Does that charge get you out of his rock? Um, six inches. Yeah. I'm right here. It does. Okay. There you go. Scary stuff. So. You, you don't have. Okay. You have one CP. Yeah, it's one CP to six and throw it. That's so stupid. I don't like that. All right, we'll go right there. Okay. And uh, they're not charging. They're not charging. Uh, I could charge the Terrain Corps veterans in, but I'm probably losing them next turn anyway. Let's get some light cover. Let's charge. Terrain Corps vets. Ooh, that's not oh. a command point <laughs> we're spending. Um, actually, honestly, what else am I spending on? Goleman can't Interrupts, that charge. really? No, I'm not interrupting. We're talking about comments. <laughs> um, <laughs> nah, they just fail. All right, Goleman. Huzzah! Uh, charging the close one. Right. Yeah. The, the Not one, trying to go around. Nope. The, whichever one I, I kept wanting to charge. So this yeah. is a five man right here? Four man. Because that's the one oh. I got healed. Oh, this is from... That's, okay. that's from the upper five man that you shot. Got it. Okay. Whee! All right. Yep. I will um. start just charging this unit. So we'll charge the eradicators in as well. That same unit? Yeah. Okay. Look, seven will do. Just really just trying to get upfield and in cover. I'm well aware of what fate awaits them. Um, start getting it worked on that cover thing. And I'm just going to check and see what this captain needs to charge here. This looks long. So that is less than... 11, so 10. So less than 10. So this is the chosen. Yep. This is the back unit yep. of... Noise Marines. Noise Marines, and they can heroic three inches. Yes, so again, the noise So marines. if I charge in here, they're just going... So we're going to leave room... Uh, we'll just charge, actually. So he can heroic. Yep. And it, it's him and these yes. two guys left. Yep. So there's no fist in that squad. There is a fist. Every squad has a fist sergeant. Oh, okay. So that I just haven't made all the fists. That's, that's just the sergeant model. Okay. So it's not sergeant. as completed right. one. We're gonna. That's fine. We're gonna sit back here then. Sorry, okay. I didn't realize that was a thing that could happen. So I don't want that to happen to me. So that they Chonka. don't get heroic into me. Uh, and then the captain will just charge into this same. Okay. Now the captain will just die. I'd rather actually be over here where you have to like spread out. Effort. Yeah. Yeah. I want. I want effort. That's all I ask for. All right, cool. Um, then we're going to just start with the Van Vets. Yep. And we're just going to spend one command point on reroll ones to hit in combat. Okay. So here we go. Pilot in three. So that all five guys are, are swinging. Yep. And no Whee! heroics. You stay out of there. Some check in. Okay. All right. I'll and then they're going to make five attacks each because they're within six inches of my banner. The nice. standard of McCrag. McCrags. One, two, three. Um, so here are the. Uh, um, bu -bu 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 -bu. Words. yeah, so here's the Words two lightning right. claws. Okay. Um, they are also going to have a chain sword attack. Yes. yes. Okay. Which one had thunder hammers? This one. Okay. Not the one that walked out to die. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. Not, not, not I was that making one. sure. I was like, wasn't like, that Mer. one. Uh, we should do the thunder hammers first. Let's be smart about this. So there are yes. two attacks base, one for shock assault, one for that. They, so four attacks each. And then the sergeant. sergeant is one more. Yep. So here we go. Unfortunately, the there is no Goldman nearby, so we're hitting on four drilling ones. Yep. We're going to hit. No Why ones. Why are you still rearing ones? Because I spent a CP. Oh, okay. Yep. CP's fine. Gotcha. Yep. John Chat doesn't yep. want you yes. to forget about Death to Traitors. Oh, wow. That's totally. I, I also have the same thing, too. So. Yeah, we're going to do Death to Traitors instead of reroll ones to hit. Okay. Is it reroll one? Or it's reroll all hits. Yeah. yeah. No, Chat. Gotcha. Chat knows. <laughs> That's so much better. Oh, okay. so thanks, well, Elijah. Man. Thank you, chat. <laughs> Twos. Yep. Hammer time. Eh, okay. Uh, we'll just let that help go. So, AP3. AP. Oh, because you put them in a cell doctrine. Yeah, I also put them in a cell doctrine. So, it'll kill 
Six right there? Six or five? Yeah. Oh, five. Five. Yep. five. All right. So, well. So there's one guy left. So we're just going to leave the sergeant. Yep. We'll just do the lightning claws real quick. Yep. Ten attacks. Threes. So we're rolling all, because that's how this works. And then there will be a number of chain swords after this. Come on, Chad, you can do us. Um, Rerolling ones. Oh, and there's one lightning claw for sergeant. It's wounds. So that fails. That many AP3. Okay. I'm one guy sure. left. Let's just <laughs> let's get this man. All right, there we go. And we're just going to consolidate and get ourselves in that sweet, lovely cover yep. so that I'm at least alive to get charged and beat up by you, Yep. which is obviously what I want here. I want to be alive to get charged and beat up. Touch, touch. The uh, next activation is yours, my friend. Okay, so we only have the one noise ring unit. Yep. Um, yeah, probably shouldn't have charged the eradicators in, but we did, and that was just silly. So I was like, oh, Gullivan's going to take care of that. Then they're just getting free movement, but you actually can hit me. Yes. Where is your power fist? Right here. So they're fighting there. Okay, so the power fist is fighting Gullivan? Uh, no, power fist is fighting here because half an inch, half an inch here. Yeah, sure. Okay. Drink. Okay. Blanca. And uh, we're going to put one guy has to go on the G-Man. Only one? The rest are, are cowards is what I'm hearing? Power fist sitting on twos. Oh, Why is he hitting on twos? Icon plus one to hit. Oh, they're just all of icons. Yeah, every, that's five sure. points. Yeah, fair enough. I, it's a reasonable thing to do. Um, two saves? Two saves. AP three? AP three. Well, I should do the basic attack first, but that's okay. That's a lot. Yeah, kills the... Kill dude, because one guy's wounded, right? Yeah. It kills the wounded man. Yep. Eee. Then I should have done this first, but I think they'll probably do nothing. T5, one, one AP1. One free up. Good. All right. Cool. That doesn't matter. Power fist to the job. All right. One on goalie. Let me swing Gullum in. Two hits. Two wounds. Two ups. Gullum in. Two hits. <laughs> Fine. He has eight um, left. We're going to come over here and base everyone. I'm just going to swing Gullum in real quick. Me. Can base. Uh, Gullum in base me there, so I can't do anything. Gullum in. I actually don't know. Is he six attack? He's got to be. <laughs> he has to be more than a Primaris captain, so he should be six attacks, seven with Jock Assault. Thomas Bird would be very, very sad right now. But I genuinely need to know. <laughs> Thomas so, Bird, are you in the chat? <laughs> uh, no, no, it's, it's in not. The it's in the Ultramarine Ultra supplement. I'm pretty sure he's six attacks base, seven on the charge. He's going to use the Sword of the Emperor because that's the highest AP, and you do actually still get a save against this. Yep. And I need you to fail him. Mortal Wounds on sixes is really good. Mortal Wounds on sixes should help. Rebuta Guillemin, six, six attacks, seven. Angels of Death, so he goes to seven. And yeah, we're going to do the AP4 one. Yep. And that is six still points. strength eight. That's perfect. Yep. Whee! Oh, three rolling hits. Nothing like it. And twos. That's uh, like six mortals right there. All right, so four saves and two D3 mortals. So kills four and then two D3 mortals on the last guy. Yeah. We'll complete the task. Yep. Excellent. Did All you right. want to tag the other unit of two? I actually do. Okay. You do. I get to punch. Uh, yep. I just want you to know that at no point am I afraid of these silly uh, noise marines. So we're going to just pile in here and base that friend? Yep. Because you don't activate. have any fallback and charge or fallback and shoot access. Is that correct? No. Excellent. Uh, so power fist. Three hits. Mm -hmm. uh, three bones. Okay. I'll see if you re-roll if I fail any of these. Nope. Go ahead. All right, basic throw. Mm -hmm. One six, so four hits. Uh, three wounds. Okay. But one's AP not relevant because you're three two up armor contempt. Oh, so it'll be yeah. AP one. AP yeah, one. Okay. Yeah. So that's all right. Two ups. Um, probably won't reroll, but my go on to seven. This is starting to get annoying. I will have three CP in your turn, which is both an interrupt and a, another reroll. Yep. Uh, it's one damage. We're just going to use the reroll sometime later. Oh, not happy about this, to be clear. But, uh, <laughs> if I roll ones, then it happens. All right. Yeah. All right. Uh, the Eradicators can just pile and consolidate. They'll just go get cover because uh, nothing else matters. Doot, doot. Still sad that I gave you an Eradicator for free. Um, oh, they've already swung. I'll go pile into them because it's okay. alternating. Yep. I can't attack them, though. I mean, I fight first. Exactly. So like, yeah. you, sw you activate them before I go in. Yeah. So... Uh, but you have fight first, but Gulliman will interrupt and yep. kill everyone. All right. So end of turn. Leaderships. Eh, I'd actually rather Overwatch. They're going to stay. They're going to touch cover stay out of combat. You did take this ejector, so that's another free for shock tactics. Yes. Three points on shock tactics. I'm still sitting at a, a singular the banner. Shock tactics? Which uh, tree is it at? Engage in all fronts tree. Okay. Yep. Um, I, however, will get 
Didn't fail morale, didn't fall back. We'll get one point on Oath of Moment. Did kill a character. So never Two point points there. on Oath of Moment. Yep. Um, and I killed in shooting. You killed three? Right? What's in up? shooting? In shooting, I killed three. I killed one, one two. two. They're alive, they owe me morale. They're alive, they, they owe me morale. They can't fail, they only lost three. Leadership nine was three. Leadership nine? Okay, cool. Uh, I fail. didn't kill this kid died in combat. Yes. Okay. So, so I get a point. So you get one point for beating me on shooting because it's three to two. Yep. But could you take morale check on the, the two now? Yep. They lost one last turn, so they only lost five this turn. So if I fail, I think uh, five, six. Five, so that goes to eight, so the two man's alive. Yep. Okay, sounds good. All right. So that'll do? Yep. So, so you will get two on banners. Two on banners. But four, four on, on primary. primary. So and I'll get a p another point on my Achilles thingy. What Achilles thingy? Uh, for killing something and shooting. More, more yeah, yeah, shooting. yeah. You got one point yeah. on the, um, what's the name? Oh, uh, canvas. Yes. Uh, adorned the canvas, adorned canvas eclectic. The yep. canvas eclectic. All right, so eclectic. you get only one point on that because I, yep. I still hold more objectives or equal to you. Yep. And, um, and I beat you in combat. Yep. And we haven't done character stuff yet. Yep. Okay. All right. All you. Cool. So well, let's think here of what our target priorities are. Yeah. Um, I do. Up to four. Mark is up to two. Two. Cool. So I think we're going to kill this captain here with this chosen. That's really just the point. I, why would you kill the captain? He is literally incompetent. Assassinate points. He's a clearly incompetent, Mark. He cannot do a single thing, I'm, apparently. So I, the idea is I'm not going to let you hurt yourself to, to hurt yourself doing failing again. Well, you're going to fail the charge, and then you will hurt yourself. I mean, Honor the Prince, I can't fail. Yeah, it's the Honor the Prince charge. Don't even lie to me, Mark. <laughs> Don't even lie to me. <laughs> it may be. Is it, though? You just never know. Golden's really only a do. basic uh, heroic, right? He heroics three. Yeah, he's not as good as other characters. Okay, so let's make sure I am not in three inches heroic if I do feel that charge. Oh, but you're not in a prince then. Uh, and these guys are just going to fall back here. Yep, touch, touch the objective. Just make sure that I, there's something there that I have to go deal with. Yep. Very sad. Big sads. Mm -hmm. Characters are totally shootable. Correct. Uh, that's cool. Yeah, I, I told you you were going to get assassinate points this turn. <laughs> This is the turn for you to get assassinated. Going for points. nine. <laughs> Go <laughs> Not Goleman is what I'm looking for here. I'm just going to kind of let Goleman alive for now at this rate. Oh, you, you're going to let him be alive. As if yeah. you could stop it. You know, I could. No, you couldn't. I it's could. Goleman. Okay, Goleman so will go walk through your army until you're out of army. What is the, when is this demon prince going to come fight Goleman? Oh, uh, he's working on it. Is he? If, if he walks over, I will go introduce you, to be clear. I'll, I can make the introduction. So... I should take an assassinate. He's going to die. I already got these two. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Come get him. So let's go up here. Yep. I'm going to Power doctrine. fists. For the record. going to be great. Assault doctrine thing. We're going to move over them, do mortal wounds with the dread claw. I don't even know what that means. Oh, uh, it just does that. Okay. Yes, because your drop pod is mobile. How many mean, points is this not a drop pod? 115. That's not bad. And it fights a melee. It's AP4. Three damage. Better than the drop pod. Yep. Very low bar there. His idea is it flies over here, does some mortal wounds. Sure. Yes. D3. For two. Okay. So it just kills a dude. Yep. It's kind of annoying, yeah. Give me that. What we're going to do here is just this guy needs to touch there. Okay. So, so the goal is everyone is touching? Uh, except for the sergeant, which I said. Sergeant couldn't quite make it? Sergeant's not quite making it. Yeah. Which that's fine. Yeah, because that, that, is, that is tricky because uh, you can't actually be under the pods in the WC format. Hmm. Every every vehicle that measures from the hole is a straight down profile. Okay, so is it like a bubble or is it like a curve? It, you cannot be underneath it. Okay. Generally, I just have them on their pie plate because they're actually on the fire base, but oh, upper, that's how they're meant to be played. But the, so much cooler on stream because it does they, look. They, they go they go awesome. a tenth of an inch into their stem and they just do not they fall over. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's just like kind of like crawling around on its little spiky legs. Yeah. I like it. So just mm -hmm. go there and there. We just want Blastmaster have options here and shoot oh, the character. Uh, the character will be fine, Mark. I assure you. Oh, that's you. a rated period pop figure, so he's only four wounds, right? Yeah, totally. It's also a regular so, ancient, so he's four wounds. Nice! Yeah, well, I had to make them no slots because I needed to put six elites in my patrol detachment. This is fair. I just, there's something wrong, but I had to do it. <laughs> um, <laughs> like, I could, I could have made this better, but I don't know, man. I like I like six elites in a patrol. Hey, Demon Prince. Oh, we're making introductions, huh? Yep. Yep, all right. I'll, I'll come over there. Um... That guy. Last master's got options. Mm -hmm. so they're just gonna go up here. Everything's fine. Everything's okay, guys. I swear. It's all right. I killed his advance in charge, so that's what I I cared about. That was yeah, that was cool. pretty good. 
Yeah, well. I, sh- I, I talked about putting the mop up here. He could have just gone back here, and I should have done that. Aha. That Instead, would help Instead, he's dead. But you know he's what dead, learning? Jim. He's dead. He's dead, Jim. Ooh, thunder. 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 Ass. You wouldn't shoot the eradicators, would you? Possibly. No, Mark. I mean, I'm four damage. Mark, you wouldn't. <laughs> Mark, no. Witness me. <laughs> no. Um. I'm tempted just to shoot Golem with the blasters. I Golem will come find them. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I will come get them. So let's sink here. Yeah, you you think you're honoring chaos? I will come collect skulls. They're just walking, not advancing. Yep. Okay. Shoot the big guns where they want to. Four options. Vice captains, how many ones? Uh, six. Okay. He's not very good. Yeah, he's already that. been cut from the list, by the way. Just like mentally, he is yeah. no longer working. <laughs> he's no longer working. Like, come on, buddy. <laughs> Like, um, no, take dude. This I'm, I'm a fighter. Yeah. I'm going to fight. You're going to come try to fight Gulliman? Oh, this no, is... No, I'm going to fight. Running away from Gulliman. I should expect no less than the cowards who broke their castle Absolutely. team Miriam. All right. Let's do a head. Mm-hmm. Do some psychic. Um, we did the mortal wounds. We did our CP there. Check, check. Psychic for their smites. I don't think I need any warp time plays. Okay. This is kind of tempting, actually, but no, I can't shoot them. I want to charge. Yes. I can shoot, but I can't charge. Um, Delightful Agonies, then from the Demon Prince, on to, if he could have got the Chosen, if I go uh, this way instead. Okay. Because then I can get closer and stay out of one. We'll yeah, put so. Delightful Agonies on the Chosen. Whee! Fails. That's oh, okay. We got him, boys. I was hoping for the perils, just that I could, it would be easier for me to kill you in combat <laughs> with my apothecary. He's got All a right. chainsword. Yep. He's I'm AP2 right now. Make sure this guy scoot over a little bit. The scene right there. Yep. All right. Let's shoot that apothecary. Why? Oh, because he's going to die. The apothecary's getting shot? Really? It's just rude. There. Couldn't get the rerolls there. Okay. So we'll do this ten, two man first. Small gun, big gun. Okay. All in the apothecary? All in the apothecary. Why? Big gun. No explodes there. Uh, you ignore all my hit penalties. Which two wounds. Cool. AP free. Light cover. Nice. nice. Small so guns. One to six. No, it's... Oh, because right. the assault weapons pop even when you're in... Uh, yes, it's... Wanting to slaughter? Yep. God, that's so crazy. <laughs> why? <laughs> why not? <laughs> why not? Why? <laughs> All right. Um, let's sink here next. That unit fell back. We got 18 bolter shots uh, coming from the... Uh, chosen just chosen. bolters? Bolter pistol melee. Yeah. They have a bolter, a pistol, and a melee weapon? Yep. Okay. Three armed chaos marines over here. Casual. Yep. So, uh, I think we'll wait to see what they do. What we will do is go ahead and do this Freeman squad. Sure. Let's just try to punk out. Do not. Um, the Apoth carry. Nope. Do not. Big gun. Please. Two little guns. Cease we'll go here. Mm, make sure he's a right off in 12. Yeah, you're fine. Right there. Boop. So, two little guns here and yep. a big gun going. And the map. Or the uh, apothecary. The apothecary, who again will make his saves. Yes. Just so we're. One hit. Oh, One wound. AP4, though. AP4, again. Oh, AP4 fails. fails. Three damage. damage. All right, well, he's totally alive. That's the problem. If it was going to kill me, I would have lived. Yeah. Here's the little guns. Mm-hmm. Want to explode? Why? Because I can. <laughs> Rule, stop. Uh, one AP2, one oh. AP, two AP1s. These are two damage. Okay. Um, um, uh, three ups. Blank. All right. So three ups. Four, four up. There's two. It's kind of annoying, yeah. Marker. Okay. All right. Um, it's next unit here. Yeah. Um, let's think here. What do we want? Two shoots. Um, Looks like most of them can see the apothecary still. He's still they're still in filling the pain range, correct? Uh, three inches, no. Oh. Oh, you didn't get the six inch one. I should have been shot. And then with most of That's okay. So live and learn. Mm-hmm. Kind of tempted to just take their sonic blasters here, punk them out. I will do nothing. Nothing, Mark. Um, let's take. So, order of operations. Mm-hmm. Let's see if the apothecary just fails to all the bolter shots. Impossible. He's at two ups, though. He is getting two ups against bolter shots. Yep. Um, oh yeah, he got oh, this. Oh yeah, yeah, he got this. We're going to just take these noise marines here. Let's confirm the kill. Okay. Put, uh, six six mortals. Mortals. Yep. Okay. How many of them are going into the apothecary? There. Make 
sure I have the rule with doctors on here. There. So we're then, uh, so Apothecary is the question. He's the answer, Mark, which He's is he takes no saves. We're going to put the four basic dudes there and put the Blastmaster okay. on them. So four basic dudes on the Apothecary, mm. who again will be totally fine. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. I'm, I'm ready for this. So Mark, Mark, Mark's feeling a little fear. He's realizing that the Apothecary mm. isn't going to fail any saves, and he's not going to roll any sixes to wound. No. And that is my favorite combination. Okay. Ones. Six is the hit. Always good. Yep. So two. Two sixes. Yep. Wonder. Okay. Toughness so four. Toughness four. So four. So sixes are still a mere man. Two mortals at least. <laughs> okay. Well, we're gonna make a bunch of saves first. Yep. Uh, to two. Those are AP two on the spear. Make those ones first. Oh no! Feel the pain. Oh no! Hey, <laughs> All right. <laughs> Three assassinate points for Mr. Perry. Yep. Fine. Blastmaster on the eradicators. Oh, why? Oh, why do you ignore cover? I have a forest right there. These are AP three, three damage pop. All well, right. Four damage pop, but. Sure, I mean, why not? Uh, AP three, so we're taking. Uh... Guys, I'm open. Yeah. Because um... if I just draw a line. Yeah. Yeah. He gets cover? Is that um, the, uh, the car container? I don't think so because I can draw a straight line for you. Because it says if I can draw a straight line to you without going over the car containers. But you are. But it's model by model. Light cover is model by model. Right, right. And you, but, but this, this guy can totally tap yeah. this guy without hitting the cargo containers. The entire model. Yes. No. That's why I think it has to be height. No. Oh. no like I'm like. Okay. You okay. Can, yeah. Oh, cool. It's, it's just him. Uh, AP three. Okay. He's probably gonna die anyway. Oh, he makes it. AP three. Oh, he fails it. Oh, he's dead. All right. Then one more. Oh, it's three. Jeez, yeah. that sucks. Um. Okay. Two guys dead. All right, Mark. They are gonna shoot your demon prince. Or Were plus. they in range of it? Yeah, they're six inches. The guy right there? Yeah, six inches. Ooh, cool, cool. Yeah. Okay. All right, so let's um, Let's do it. We're going to get this guy. So the multi melta. Yep. Four plus? No. Oh, I cannot see if you this. The, the melta rifle. No! Oh, not punished! I, I just want one thing! <laughs> <laughs> it was day six plus four damage. <laughs> Nope. Get out of here. It would have been a whole demon prince just dead. Yep. Dang it, Mark. <laughs> Come on, man. Okay. Shot, shot, shot. Chosen over there, gonna shoot the Lord just to clink wounds. Oh, the captain? Yeah. Very disrespectful. Continue. 10, 14. Yeah, they're probably all 18. They haven't killed anything, so they don't count as all doctrines. Oh. That's a rule. Cool. This two is not part of it. So that's a cool thing that they do, but it only really matters for the bolters. Yeah, just if you can bolter down something yeah. cheeky. It matters in the melee if you get early game kills with it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you're already in all the doctors. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Fives, he rides a bike. He wants to ride a bicycle. You ignore the armor AP plus one. Yeah, so there's before saves. Before saves. A sad. <laughs> Big okay. Sense. Uh, it's got four left. Yep. All right. All right. Mm -hmm. Let's take this unit here and charge here. Sure. Who's charging what? Oh, uh, the uh, two-man squad here. Oh, sure. Oh, they didn't uh, advance. They just walked. Yeah. Ew. Very good. Not that. All right. They can stay where they want. Yep. Okay. Let's take the... Uh, those guys are just going to charge that captain. Get that out of, of the way. He's going to be fine. He's Centers. not within six of Gulliman, so that's not really an overwatch that's going to happen. Continue. All right. The idea is we could be okay if we think about it. So we're not getting know. on that objective. I feel like he's going to be all right. Besides the fact he lost his job already. No, he has lost his job. But there's no need to kick him while he's down. Uh, how far are they going? Six inches. Is that going to get the whole unit in? Probably. I mean, with pile and consolidates, yeah. yeah so you, well, consolidates now. Yeah. So the Galactic guy, yeah, nine inches should get within half of the friend. Yep. All right, cool. Should have considered charging both of these because I could have done that. Mm -hmm. Then I would have overwatched with the Eradicators. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Over here. Dread Claw is charging both because I can. Sure. Um, Don't ask me why the Dread Claw can charge. Nom nom Boop. nom 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 All right. Nom 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 nom. All right. Um. Let's take these guys, charge those guys. Everything is fine. Six. Yeah. So, 
Probably just going to keep our guys in cover. Let's fair, fair. That seems reasonable to John. All right, we got this. Okay. Yep. We're going to take this free main here, and I think we're just going to charge here. Yeah, that's fair. Just want to remove models. I, I'm running low on models, Mark, but it's all right. We don't need that many to kill this Demon Prince. Well, the Demon Prince, is he's going to die. Like You will not get characters at the end of this. That's what I care about. <laughs> Demon Prince, he's done. He's done. He's done for. All right. Um, I could have actually hilariously popped it. Put an action there. Then the uh, put the banner. That's hilarious. Oh, uh, you didn't outnumber me. I'm obsec. Oh, then yeah, I'm you just did. a troop. Okay, right? fair enough. But I'm not gonna do that because I want to save. I'm not CP. obsec, so that's yeah. that's pretty easy. <laughs> Downside of not taking troops. Yep. Yep. I'm out. Okay. Let's see it. Start an agent. Mm -hmm. Meeps. Meeps. You're not even gonna honor the prince. Nope. Classic blunder. All right. Then. Uh, gonna do is make sure these guys are swapped around if mm -hmm. I can get the real ones by sacrificing one dude that had the power fist yeah you'll be fine important stuff all right and then so, but wait there's more but wait there's more I think does he have a melee weapon he's a lightning claw wonderful okay he rerolls wounds and he does six we swing here first then <laughs> okay <laughs> um ancient has a chain sword yep I assume he comes with one swimming well, let's think of where this guy actually wants to be. He wants to be right here. Okay. Uh, the real ones. Whee! Power fist. Real ones. Nope. Oh, three hits. Okay. If I could transhuman, this would have been the spot. Three wounds. These are AP uh, four. Ow. That's, that hurts more than it doesn't. All right. Two AP fours. Kill them both. Why? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, Still just, just one three. below on everything. All right. Basic bros. Yep. I'll leave the sergeant with a thunder hammer because he's angry at you. Yeah, oh, that's fair. not. There you go. Uh, twos, real ones. Yes. One six. And then fives. Fours? No, yeah, definitely fours. Okay, I was like, brain first? I was asking if you were strength five in the worst possible way. <laughs> uh. Uh, AP one doesn't matter because you have more nope. contempt. It does. Uh, this could be a place to reroll, but like maybe not. Not at that point. He's dead. Yep. Wink. Sad man. Sads of mans. Um, chosen or minus one to wound? Yep. Wound among fives? Yep. And they got three wounds bop. Three wounds each? Yeah. Gee, that's going to take forever. Um, yeah, you're fine. You can just kill the captain. Go right here. Sure. Power fists. Um, here, mm -hmm. here, here. Dun, dun, dun. Powers of Fist. Yes. Real ones. Oh, sad. Five hits. Why? Five wounds. These are AP4. Yep. Normal guys. They're one left. They're super dead. Jeez. All right, we're running out of Tyrannic War veterans here. All right. Uh, we're going to come over here mm -hmm. for free. Go right there. We may try to trap you in a shenanigan way if we can. Seems unlikely. We should totally do impossible. that with these guys. We should. Okay. Fuck the cover. Screw. Oop. Ignore that, guys. Hi, YouTube. Bye, YouTube. <laughs> All right. So we've got uh, the Dreadclaw is about to make its attacks, right? Yep. It hits on get... fours. Okay. I have no idea what a Dreadclaw does. Strength 12 minus four free. Four attacks. What, it, what makes you think I'm going to have models here? I, I, I You just not hit. See? One hit. All right. Uh, AP two five. Hit. Yeah, two hits. Freeze, don't hit. Only no, hits on exploding fours. sixes. It doesn't have that yet. Oh, it's Forge World. Sure. Uh, AP five. Yeah. So clean kills guy. These have all, all already moved. Yep. All right. So Dread he, he can just walk out. Yeah. Well, he's not. The Dread Claw's not going through the ruin. True. So he will just walk out in a second. Okay. Then uh, mm -hmm. two guys in cover. Dread Claw goes chumpy. Yep. Chumpy. Okay. And then Demon Prince. There is a Demon Prince. Power fists. Um, I'm a pile. He's fine for this moment. Yep. Not power fist. Claw. Sword. Swords. One six. Twos. Two, two, two. Ancient. This is probably uh, bad. This is AP4. Sure. Versus AP3. All right. Damage on this? Three. Yep. AP4. That's not, not, <laughs> not fair. AP3s. Great effort, champ. He's going to take 12. Yep. On a four plus, he makes one attack. 
Ancients. There's a reason you don't see them, apparently. Oh my god, my ancients are 12 into our ignore morale. Yeah, but he's going to engage this guy right here. Pass that idiot. Oh. Sure. All right, well, he will still be leaving you. Yep. All right. Uh, then, uh, chosen. Chosen? Into this captain? Yep. So how many, this is, uh, how many attacks each? Oh, uh, this is going to be, let me see, 40, or 37? 37, because you've yep. got a nine man here? Yep. Okay. Dadgel, so four Please. attacks each. And now they're hitting on, do they have an icon? They have an icon. So they're hitting on twos, twos. no rerolls? No rerolls, but strength five. Pretty good. Probably the end of the captain. But I'm going to make you roll these out because my armor is contempt. And you can't have armor of contempt and then, like, be fond of your opponent. I mean, and you yeah. got four pin bolts anyway. Them. Exactly. I have a four pin bolt and nothing but disrespect to my heart. <laughs> it's, I'm going to enjoy it and not even not even a problem. All right. The important thing here is that Gulliman is going to continue to just cut his way through Sergeant. the bloody remnants that are trying to escape Everything. Him. Yeah. Gulliman don't care. All right. All right. Violence, twos, exploding sixes. Yep. Nah. Do Keep do do. dropping these ones. Yep. All right, there we Get go. those ones um, out there. Five, mm. ten bonuses. Two more. Ten ahead. sixes? Yep. Okay, Nick. Come on, man. Hey, that's a false emperor, baby. A fours. Sixes, AP four. I, AP's not going to matter here. I know. <laughs> We're just going to take a lot well, of I'm just flexing pimples, and I'm enjoying it. And you will be absolutely stunned by the amount of captains alive. Drugs. All right. All right, Mark. Oh, it's not even that many. Get those out of here. Whee! All right. Take these saves. All right. Only damage one. He tried. He did lose at least four. Um, you know what? I've got enough CP to fight on death next turn, which means, uh, should we do it now? We're not killing the Chosen. Uh, no, no, I've got some tricks in my sleeve. We're going to hold on to that. So Captain's dead. Okay. Very sad about it. So we're going to put so some Mark, Mark guys will get another engage six right points here. on Assassinate. Yep. Uh, <laughs> engaging a Thunderstrike. That's effective. You know, force a fall back. Yeah, yeah. Ultramarines. I mean, might as well hit that. Ultramarines. You're no longer intact. Or it's turn. Yeah, I know. I know. Okay. Uh, but, um, I was like, I'm sarcasm. Just gonna, I'm just going to fall back and we, we'll be shooting you anyway. Okay. We're ultramarines. Ultramarines cannot move because they're closer there. Mm -hmm. All right. We're doing it, Mark. All right. Punch it with the thunder. Thunder uh, strike. Only one hit, sadly. My thunder, wounds. thunder. Oh, my, my, my <laughs> stupid. Fine. <laughs> it gets to live. All right. We're going to start killing this demon prince. I got nine points for assassinate out Excuse there. Excuse me, I'm not even done. The devastator's going to hit you. Oh, yeah. Whee. As I said, he's hitting the demon prince for the record. Of course. Uh, one wound? One. Jeez. Ah, disgusting. All right. We're doing it, Mark. Yeah. Um, so Mark, did you get anything for... Assassinate, nine points. Okay. Assassinate is nine. Uh, it's the yeah. end of the battle round. Uh, how so, many things did I kill in melee there? Uh, you killed the captain. Killed the, the captain, bandits. them, so two, them. Three? Yep. What did you kill in shooter? And uh, ancient. And ancient, four. So you I think I'm killing more in melee. Probably melee, but the golden's going to have words. Apothecary? Yep. Um, was it, I think it was just the apothecary. Just the apothecary. All right, well, we're getting you on that one. We, yeah. we both finished We yeah. do indeed, up to five. Yep. Heck yeah. Game All right. TV. Back to so this guy's done with your shenanigans. Killed something in mail of a character, which right. I don't think your I character I assume you want to try and block this. Say what? You want to try and yeah, block Yeah, I'm kind of blocked that, yeah. Okay, sure. Okay. Um, I'll just spend the two CP. Desperates. Whee! We're going to move right here, end within an inch, and die, so I don't give you more kills. <laughs> <laughs> so you. I'll show you. <laughs> this kid's on there and just give it seppuku. I don't even care. No, we're, we're, this demon prince is getting lit up, like the 4th of July. Um, all right, the one angriest apot. This eradicator, where his brothers perhaps were underperforming a little bit. This guy's going to do it. <laughs> um, thunder strikes. Let's just be closer to him than the chosen. Yep. That looks pretty easy. I've got 16 inches of clean movement. Uh, we'll drop a command point on the storm speeder fallback and shoot instead of using either of the ultimate fallback and shoot. Oh, okay. um, they're just existing. They heroic three. We're going to ignore that. Uh, Gulliman. I think he's going to go beat these guys up on his way over to the Demon Prince. Yep. And then the Eradicator is going to shoot this guy off. Yep. Easy. Easy. Gully, gully. Whee! And that's too long of a charge. Okay, so uh, Eradicators will just move this way. 
in their journey to make friends with them. Uh, should very well be within six, looks like it is. Screw those guys. Um, all right. And then that thunder, thunder strike Thunderstrike works. does need to do something. Uh, he, you know what? Let's just go get this demon prince. You don't get to have characters, Mark. <laughs> I'm done with it. I'm done. Heck yeah. Let's All right. go. Um, hmm. I will lose both Thunder Strikes in about three seconds. Um, glory. Yeah, I like the glory of the dead demon prince has got me. You, you, you're right, Mark. He's going down. <laughs> <laughs> Screw that guy. All right, um, let's start uh, yeah. shooting. So Gulliman is going to rapid fire those, um, those dudes. Can the Eradicator shoot down here if I do that? Also yeah, can. 24. Yeah. Yeah, they've got, they've got these guys. Yeah. Okay. Gulliman's going to shoot them. Go ahead. It'd be awesome if this works. Um, oh, actually, Gulliman can just shoot them and they don't get cover. Yep. They're, they're going to be getting catching the rockets. We're going for damage, Mark. Damage. I like, I like him some damage. Your hero could, could be with anything, right? Yeah. Six inches uh, on characters. I'm like actually wondering if I should keep him alive and just go walk right here because if I kill him, I can test the objective. All right, we're going to keep the Grab Marine alive, Mark. I'm sorry, but we're doing it. Because I'm realizing that I'm going to kill all your stuff See, and shoot anyway. See, he just dies anyway, then. Yeah, hold on. We're going to put him down first. Okay, okay. There we go. Two plus. All right. Okay. See, he's fine. All right. Uh, so, Gulliman is in tack talk. No longer in tack talk, so he's not full rapid firing, actually. Yep. Let's, let's get this stuff done. Uh, we're going to go missiles into these yep. and uh, big shots there. So mice one hit for that one? For who? Because it fell back. No, I spent a CP. Oh, so you All the fall back and shoot it natively. Period, natively. I spent a CP to ignore that because I'm yep. not in the mood. Uh, this one Maybe is absolutely. not rerolling one to hit. Yeah. Big shots. Sweet. Uh, these will all be threes. It doesn't matter. Yep. Uh, Four against you. Yep. One, two. Two. All right. First one. We're good. Second one. We're going to think about CP there. Mmm, the pain train's coming. Choo -choo. Party! Got it. Why? <laughs> Alright, uh, 2d3 here. Uh, 1, 2, 3. Consistency. Bad. Uh, two saves on the noise rings. Uh, that one is not within 12 of Goleman. Alright, this next one is within 12 of Goleman. Uh, we're gonna do an eradicator. Big shots. First. Eradicator. Okay, eradicator. Glory. Two hits. Uh, no, he's not stationary anymore. Ah, I should have just done that. Oh, well. Just go ahead. No, oh, I, I didn't. Um, and I wanted to save a CP for a reroll on damage or something. Do whatever you want. Wounds ya. Four up. Okay. Why? Because we got a four pin bolt against shooting for some reason. All right, well, we're going to shoot the next Thunderstrike at you. Screw it, everything's going there. We're not okay. shooting noise rings anymore. Uh, one, two, three. Yep. One, two, three. Take one. Okay, so rolling. Yep. I get to oh, roll damage. Yeah. Go ahead. Five. Five. Nice. All right. Oh, four. is that the last cannon? Yeah. Well, okay. the, all, all three of their shots are D6 damage. Gotcha. Um, it might have been a wing missile, but against you is identical. Yep. Uh, 2D3. So he's got three wounds left. Yep. I'm going to charge him. Three wounds left, right? Yep. Okay. Uh, three wounds left. Two's rolling ones. Counting. One, two, three. And one, two, three saves. One, two, three saves. All right. Ah, nah. Armor Contempt is probably going to stop it. Good. No. All right. Well, we we'll, we have not given up yet. Uh, one, two, three have shot. That's bad. Um, these eradicators cannot shoot him. Nope. Um, but I'm angry. <laughs> Dang it. Um, Goleman will shoot these idiots here because he can't yeah. shoot them. All right. Twos. Threes. Try again. Uh, okay. Two. Two. Mm -hmm. On this squad. Yeah. Walker. Good? Yeah, no, this good. is doesn't actually shoot very hard. Um sad. This is this isn't looking good for the home team here. Alright, those eradicators are gonna shoot the guys in cover just to try Yeah, just that. confirm that kill. Just get that objective out of the way, annoyingly. I wanted to give you the zero on primary, but I also wanted the demon prince, and apparently I don't get to do either of those things. No. Uh here's a multi melta. Yep. Okay. Four invulns. Four invulns. So I got the guy in the open six ups, right? Uh six ups against him. All right, yeah, that, that'll do, pig. That'll do. All right. Um, unfortunately, hmm, it's not great. Goldman's gonna charge those guys. Oh, I don't crap. think I can declare the demon prince because he's just too far away. Um, but yeah, Goldman is gonna just walk, walk the other side of this, and we're gonna go hunting. All right. 
and then uh, not quite brave enough to charge that demon prince with a thunder strike. Very bad. sad that he's alive. You do have a command point. Which I am. Means you've got heroic potential. I'm on a heroic. Yep. And uh, we're gonna go six inches right here. Okay. Yeah. Fair enough. All right. All right. Uh, you swing first, bro. Yeah. Go middle. Swing. Uh, into these little guys. I'll make sure is Gulliman's not quite within four. Oh, I can't pile in towards you, unfortunately. Yeah, but I'm seeking after you kill me. Fair. Um, like three. Yep. Oh, yeah, just okay. tell me where you want to be. All right. Just make it where if you, when you pile in closer, I can still get it on you and contest that objective. No, we, we ain't doing that. All right. Um, so 2d3 mortals and that many AP force. <laughs> All right. Get these noise marines out of here. We don't want that. I swing first next, or after you pile in. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm outside of four. Yeah, I mean, I don't... We're outside of three. Yeah, I don't think you will be able to get on. Unless you're trying to not engage Goldman. I'm going to engage Goldman. I accept. Okay. The idea is we're just going right. to both be on the objective. Fair enough. You can beat up my Thunderstrike. I'm going to put myself so you don't get to swing on me, but if you kill the Thunderstrike, you consolidate. Could yeah. engage Goldman if you want the objective. Because okay. Goldman will fight you. Sounds like six. Okay. Those are AP free. All right, we got this. Nice. I don't care. Oof. Never even so heard. This three, demon prince doesn't even have a name. One talent. Hits. One moon AP. Two bin. Because I'm first shoulder. Cool. No. Well, if that's the case. Uh, <laughs> are you just going to go over here? Oh, really? He doesn't want to engage Golden anymore? Nope. <laughs> no? Nope. No, he doesn't. Right at one inch. And right. just touch an object on the side. <laughs> so you are engaging Goldman. Yes, I'm totally engaging Goldman. All right, cool. Well, I'm going to pile in this. Uh, you're not within an inch of that. Inch there? Cool. If you can check out. There you go. Kind of hard to see it up here. Yeah, right? it's fine. Okay, right there. And that is on the side of it. Yes. Okay, sure. All right, engaging Goldman. But first, you must survive the Storm Speeder, who is actually very angry at you and is not even degraded. Nope. <laughs> I didn't even kill you. You're rolling ones, two hits. Probably not. T6? T6? Nah, it's not strength okay. 6. Strength 5, but maybe. All right, well, it'll pile and consolidate. Oh, am I brave enough to just go 6 around and touch that? I think I am, Mark. You are? Okay. Well, yeah. Can I'm you fit, though? We are about to find out together. That's the edge of his base right now. Yeah, if you want to use the ever base, just use the ever oh, base. Yeah, so he needs to get right there. Can they do it? 6 inches. Going around the curve. I can't see from my angle, so. Looks like just let me know. Okay. Yeah, you can just go right there. Cool. Boop. All right, so he'll go there. And then he'll be up top. Yep. And this absolute champion of the Imperium has seven wounds left. And nice. the whole reason that this matters is because I don't want Mark to hold more than me. Yep, because that's another bonus point. I don't want it's it's a lot that of. That would have been the five. Point. You did If I do that, I hold more than you. Yeah, you yeah, I, I know got the five more. points on the infrared shoulder one, because I killed more in shooting. Yeah, you did. Killed, killed more you man. killed one in shooting. Oh, yeah. And I killed one in shooting. True, true. Never mind. Yeah. Yep, uh, never mind. They actually came to work, even though none of this wanted to. <laughs> All right, Mark. All right. You're going to leave that Demon Prince in for Goldman? Yeah. I have All a right, good. Cap, We're going to do this. You, you fight a lot. You have a phase cap? Yeah. You have three wounds left. I don't care if you have a phase cap. Cheers. <laughs> Goldman! <laughs> <laughs> the extra D3 attacks. Yep. <laughs> All right. Fair. So gain the CP. Yep. Oh, um, I will as well. Three commander points. So Mark is going to get a four on primary because you've got the yep. obstacle right there. I got right the obstacle there. I get two banners. Two, two banners. Five. Just top five. Yep. So. Mm hmm. Let's probably gonna use this to do another action of shoot, then place another bomb. That's just rude. Uh, what did you score on the door and the canvas one? Uh, canvas, more in shooting, more, or not more in shooting, more in melee, mm -hmm. more uh, in uh, character versus character fight. Um, bam. My character killed something. Your character killed one, my character it's killed It's character one? versus character, the dueling. Oh, story. only in duels. Yeah. Insanely specific, all right? <laughs> yep. Ugh. All right. Fine. Uh, I will get two points on oath. I no, I fell back. Didn't kill a character. Hold the center. One point on oath, not two. Okay. Sad. Now oath is just not really what it used to be. No. I think we're just gonna fly um, over this guy and do the mortal. You did hold that one with noise marines. Yes. And now I hold it with. Uh, I hold it. So you oh, three so it's points. three points. Shock tactics. Whoop whoop. Shock you tactics. said that sec the secondary is bad. I I did, but it's actually working out better than all my other ones. So we're gonna see so. if we do mortal wounds to this guy. Yes. Why? For two? Why? Ah, he didn't die in the shooting or combat phase. You uh, fool. You fool. All right. Um, 
Vin, we're going to. We got Internal Vendetta. We got real wounds against. Gulliman? G Man, yeah. Ooh, who's Internal Vendetta? The Demon Prince. How convenient. <laughs> <laughs> That's unfortunate. It's all right. I've got an interrupt with your name on it, Mark. Yep. All right. Um. So I think we're going to move a unit, shoot move. it, and fire bombs. Or place a bomb. Place a bomb, yep. And that'll be your command point? Yep. Hot. Sink these guys. I mean, you could. No, you're within 12. So you have to get outside of 12 of any existing bombs to do it. Which That's looks, not a 9. It's a 9 now? Yeah, I believe oh, it's a 9. change? That's just 9 on there. It was always 9? Wow, I really thought it was 12. All right, well, that's cool. I was wondering if the uh, the, the drop pod could do it. No. But it looks like it is still within 9. But they, they can easily yeah, walk Yeah, they just it. walk over. Yeah, no, they, that's not going to be a problem. Well, the Chosen. What are they doing? What are these? What, what are they doing? <laughs> they take away your banner. Make your life hard. Not yet, they won't. But soon, yes. Yes. <laughs> just in case. No. There we go, right there. It's all right. Gulliman is going to be king of the hill. Two guys right there for currency. This guy goes on the other side. Mm -hmm. and we got plenty of flex room here. I'm going to overwatch. I know. Yeah. Overwatch. Woo. Overwatch. All right. All right, Mark. Um, we're going to place a bomb. So that's an additional eight points for me on primary, for primary, Charlie. So honest question. Well, it'll happen at the end of the game. Yeah, but go ahead and put it down. I now, can action it away. With an infantry unit? Or an OPSEC unit? OPSEC to complete immediate, to complete automatically? Yeah, because it's turn five. I think. I thought otherwise complete at the end of the game. We, we can yeah. check. I'll need to have a Storm Speeder alive, so let's, let's, let's hold see. that back. We <laughs> yeah. can check in a minute. Um, These Noise Marines. Uh, yeah, but they're, they're, they don't score yet. They score at the end of the game, because I have the opportunity to action them away. Hey, <laughs> what does that mean, Charlie? What does that mean? Um, we may shoot this. is gonna do just fine. Speeder, actually. You wouldn't dare. I would. Why? I guess why not? Why? Um. Yes. Yes. That's right. Okay. So, let's go ahead and do some spells. Mm -hmm. Smite the G-Man. Smite on the G-Man. Nope. I was waiting for that, that explosive peril to come down <laughs> from the sky. All right. Then let's go ahead and mm -hmm. do... Uh, um, let's think here. Mm -hmm. This unit. Right up here. Okay. So everything into the speeder? Yep. Uh, so it looks like the Blastmaster is obviously in half range. looks like the little yep. guns aren't. I thought they were when I was it trying to go over here. If, yeah, you, were, if you were trying to. You got yeah. it? All right, cool. Uh, yeah, no, that looks good. All right. So everyone's this is a five man that haven't been hurt yet. Yep. Nice. All right. Big guns and blast. Master. Yeah. All hit. Why? But uh, Mark, what, you were shooting. Wounds. You were shooting through a forest, Mark. I don't give a crap. Oh. Or say you make it. Storm speeders too tough to kill. Wow. Too Apparently the answer was for me to throw my storm speeders at Mark's army. Should have been he, he just every, can't kill them. Every turn, but you're like, no, I'm gonna take them back because they're gonna die. I thought so, but apparently they're invincible. That was a secret chat. Uh, that was a lot of sixes. That's a lot of sixes. That's oh. five sixes. Oh, Nelly. Why? Because, you know, I get turn two oh, onwards. Bad. Fives. And Fives. Sixes will actually matter on the AP. Yeah, sixes will matter. will be four ups. So that two sixes? Two sixes, four fives. All right, cool. All right, Storm Speeder. Yep. All right, he, he has got this. Two sixes. Hey. Makes them both. Three ups. Loses one. He's got eight wounds left. That's, uh, that's fine. Two damage each? Yeah. So I failed one. You failed one. Oh, that's four. Yeah, yeah the, four, right. the four makes oh, so it. When you said six, of all, my brain scattered. Yeah. Derps. That's fair. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, me. Um, I meant the six is like the six is to wound. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, makes perfect sense. Ha. Ah. They've killed something in melee, so uh, oh, they get all. Hits on their Vulcans. Yeah. It's a little disrespectful, Mark, <laughs> but continue. Three guys in range. Yep. And then uh, six guys outside of range. Nice. Bonka. Mm -hmm. Three sixes. Looks pretty good. Just all around good unit. Oh, uh, nothing AP matters because you have armor to kill. Three wounds. Woohoo! This is on the speeder? Yep. He doesn't care. Oh Take no, wounds. down to seven. <laughs> all right. All right, Blastmaster's gonna shoot you. No. Um, From the free man. Mm -hmm. Two hits. All right. One AP four. Are you, yeah, I don't mind. You know what's gonna happen. Oh, I don't know. You've been pretty oh. bad with the AP4 stuff, so four damage. <laughs> Too little gun. 
<laughs> Four damage mark. I do need to make sure one guy's on this objective. You, no, know? you <laughs> certainly do not. <laughs> one six. All right. Uh, one wound. Two damage. Jeez. Fine. It's fine. See? Yeah, Everything, cool. Everything's okay. Whee. And then we're going to do shot, 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 shots. Charges. Let's take those chosen charges, eradicators. Ooh, I see, I that. no rerolls. No, maybe. Oh, Am I looking for? Just the measure. That's looking pretty close. It is. I think I'm gonna have eradicators. I'm not overwatching some sixes. Oh, I think oh, I'm God. just out of four. Yeah, Mark I'm out of CP. Out. <gasps> Can't reroll that. But I think that's just okay. It, maybe. <laughs> but if you roll a one on the charge into Golem, and not a two, a two would make it. But a one would fail. <laughs> yeah. All right. All right, let's take Dreadclaw, charge these three messes. Uh, we'll just charge here. Just the eradicator? Just eradicator. Because we'll pile into that thing. What's the... um. The claws thing? Strength 12 minus defense, 4. Defense, defense, oh, defense. 9 wounds, T6, armor contempt. T6. It's only one shot. Not getting rerolls from Golem. It's not a good Overwatch, but it's the one I want to do. There we go. All right, guys, we got a $5 super chat from Matt O. He Matt wants o. to say, hey, y'all, what do y'all think about a Caladius to pressure armies starting with 1 to 2 CP? Also, the Lord Commander is going to kill all of these weirdos. The Lord Commander of <laughs> the Imperium is about to literally slaughter every Chaos Basement here. I think that a Caladus Assassin, though, is... Uh, I think that a lot of people aren't actually going to use command points on turn 1, and then you're not going to be able to afford to spend 2 CP to extend it. So I don't actually think a Caladus Assassin is that good because people don't have command points to spend. Shockingly enough, everyone thinks that the Caladus got better. I think it got worse because no one can spend command points on turn one because they all start at zero now. Yay. Caladus Assassin. Caladus Assassins. All right, Goleman is so not amused by this. <laughs> like, who's who's even daring right now? All right, we're going to do the noise rings first. Not the Prince. Not the Prince, I think. Okay, his funeral, yeah. not mine. Yep. I'm going to go ahead and put myself at one CP for the interrupt, but yep. I'll carry on. Gully, gully. Gully, gully, gully. Let's sink here. Hmm. Hmm. Do I do it or not? Do you do what? The question is, does he want to kill the prince, right? Like, Gulliman wants Gulliman to kill the prince. Gulliman is going to kill the prince. Screw it, no. Okay. Demon prince first. Go ahead Demon and prince yourself. first. All right. All right. Let's see it. For the memes. Oh, they are. we're, we're going to be memeing. No sixes. Doesn't need them. Real wounds. That could have been cool. Involves, five right? these, yeah, it's just involves for you. Three damage right, pop. Three, three damage a pop. I might use a reroll here. So, all right, I am at three right now. Yep. Um, Take three. It's got four left. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. Four Talon. Um, One hit. Real wounds. No. Real wounds. Why? Because why not? That's AP2. Just involves. Yep. Three pin bone. Good. All right, four left. Yep. Go in. Absolutely not. Slapping the deep. Oh, I hold on. I'm popping my ability. I have D3 extra attacks. I don't want to die. All right. Base cap, D3 attacks. Two. One hit. Three roll wounds. That works. Okay. Get out cool. of here. Cool. Toxic right. Elixir does not do it. Goldman's going to pick up his noise burn unit. Okay. I don't like your obsec. Whee! Three rolls. Whee! Might use a CP here. God, <laughs> <laughs> why? <laughs> Why? Um, yeah, screw this. We're rolling that, rolling all of these. All right, five saves. He's dead. This is your free damage, right? This is on the eight. Noise Marines. Oh, Sorry. Noise Marines. Oh, yeah, okay. this is on the Noise Marines. So you owe me one more. Kills three of them? Oh, three of them. Why? There are two Why? special guys are left. How is the Sword of the Emperor AP4? I don't know. Come on. I mean, don't that's pretty good. Ones, John. Yeah, well. I can't even feel leadership with just layers. I, yeah, you will. I'm um, Legion 9, bro. Yeah, the Storm Speeder still hasn't swung yet. Continue. I'm taking you out of combat range for it. He's in, he's got the Demon Prince. He's got the Demon Prince. All right, so let's do these Noise Marines. Power Fist, tubes. Real ones. Two sixes. That's about good. Uh, the one. Yes, still, the yeah. one's out. Yep. Three ah. balloons. Why? Four in bones. Yeah. He just died. Well, well hold that thought. <laughs> Might not. Oh, l let me know at the end of the phase. Okay. Drag claw. Yep. Three hits. Twos. Uh, AP four. Okay. Two is actually good. One more. 
Strength? Twelve. Why is it strength twelve? I don't know. <laughs> All right. Face you got this him. one? Sure. Fuck okay. They fall back and shoot. All right. Don't me. Yep. Doesn't care. Okay, stand back up. Someone's dying for this. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. Um, oh, the uh, Sorb Tutor's going to whack the Dune Prince. Yeah. Now that you have foolishly wasted your... your one hit? Uh, three hits. Oh, nice. They have... Oh, because oh, they're speeders. Open skill three. One save. Get that man a wound. Take a wound. Oh, he's getting shot. I mean, Drake will block him. Not from here, it doesn't. <laughs> no, it does it. <laughs> no, it doesn't. Not from there. Um, All right. Oh, Gullman has wounds left. We'll just find out how many. <laughs> the amount he needed is what I just heard. He has the wounds he needs. 100% more than he has. 100%? Yeah, this is a oh, significant yeah. increase. All right, we ready? Yeah, dude, it's your turn. I gain a CP. All right, I gain a CP as well. You lose your banner. Uh, I do. So I you do. get no banner points this I don't, turn? I don't need banner points. You're going to take your banner points away. Primary, you get zero? Uh, I, phew, it's my turn five, buddy. I got, oh, I yeah, got a 12 oh, coming yeah, oh, your yeah. way. Okay, okay. All right. Um, those red are going to walk there, hold that one. We're going to kill this. Yeah, that's that important. Um, and then he's going to go contest that, and I'll hold two to your one. That's what's about to happen. Okay. Unless those noise brains just survive. Yeah, if they survive Gullum in again, then I deserve it, I guess. <laughs> they also have to survive the Eradicators, to be clear. <laughs> but we'll, we'll work on that problem. All right. I'm getting points. Wee! Boop. No. Um, uh, it leaves at the command phase. And there's so the command phase. That's hilarious. Great. Um, they're still gonna probably just murder people. Uh, it's a new, uh, I have a command point. I'll just, do I want to doctrine anyone? All right. I want to hold a new objective. It's that. I want to be in the center. It's that. I want primary. It's that. And then there's banners. It's just the center. It's just the center. Mosh pit and center. And you can't place any banners. Nope. Um, so this one would like to contest the objective. Yep. Although I could just, 16 inches probably doesn't get me to that one. Uh, it does. Oh, yeah. But I can't shoot anything. Yeah. That's not it. Okay. I like shooting. Um, yeah, it's fine. Boop. Uh, out of heroic range of Dreadclaw, because just, I don't know. It's not going to risk that. Yeah. <laughs> that would be silly. Crap. <laughs> no. Um, but he should be able to see the noise marine. Yeah. So we're going to shoot him. All right. Uh, Gulliman is just happily standing one inch away. And then the um, Spider is going to go here. So that it can um, shoot the demon and prince if the noise marines are gone, and then the eradicators can both see the demon and prince if. Uh, although no, this is closer, and that that's closer, so they're not going to be shooting here. So eradicators going to shoot the noise marines. Okay. All right. Molten melt up. Yep. Uh, they have been twelve at Goldman, or how easily could they be? Probably good. Yeah, they could be. Okay. Yeah. If you just want to walk the guy. Meep. Thanks. Yeah, I just want to reroll ones. So molten melt doesn't care. Get these noise marines out of here, Mark. Three. All right. Screw those noise marines. All right. Um, Goleman. Yep. He's going to shoot the demon prince. Okay. He doesn't deserve a clean death. All hits. Fives. Two. Two. Three ups. He's <laughs> yeah. gone. He's gone. Boop. All right. Um, Is that how, another how? three for yeah, it's another three for shock tactics. I think I'm somehow getting a 12 of shock tactics and like no other points. But it's also points uh, for, uh, oh, because I wanted to kill your characters. Yep. Um, so I currently have a 12 on primary. 12 on primary. I don't have any banners. Nope. Shock tactics is good. Oath is good. Yep. So I don't think there's any more points I can score. But I can shoot, kill all your noise marines. And I would like to do that. <laughs> um, <laughs> I would like that very much. So he's going to shoot first. Okay. Put his um, uh, missiles here. Yep. Big shots there. Gotcha. This is not that's, that's, that's your speeder's wound. But oh, yeah, yeah. It don't matter. Yeah, that's fine. All right. Yeah, missiles there, big shots there. We're going to get okay. this done. Missiles. Whee! Uh, that's, yeah, three shots. Um, one, two AP3 on the, the clock. No! Yeah, one. AP3 fills one. D6 damages. How many wounds? Nine. Sure. Six! Down to three. Thank you. I think you meant three. Uh, 2d3 here. This yep. guy's full tier still. Uh, four shots. Uh, oh, Gulliman. Oh, reroll those ones, buddy. Whee! Uh, just two saves. We got one. Still, dude? Yep. All right. 
this storm speeder is not going to fail me. Big shots, little shots. Yep. Take me home. Big shots. Oh, he's not rerolling ones. <laughs> it's all right. One. Fail it. Don't fail. Get the men out of here. Explosion. Oh, oh yes. Kill the noise marines. It only does one more wound. It's not it does range. one? Yeah, it's three inches to one. This model is three inches for one. Yes. I'm going to pick it up because it's off my table. <laughs> this is three inches it for is. one. Could I toss this like a nerf like football? Just out of anger? Yeah. Just like that way? Yeah. I want you to aim a little bit more right about there. Right that way. <laughs> Just think of it as a face hugger. All right. We're throwing this off screen, right? Yeah. Here we go. See? There we go. Crack, snack, Built Marky Top. There we go. All right. <laughs> Two to three shots into the noise marines. It fits on the head. It's like five. 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 More than free for the first time. Literally. I, thank you for noticing. <laughs> yeah, I noticed. Um. Ballistic skill three. That's good. I'm going to use a CPU reroll on one of these. Jack is getting caressed by the jungle on the background. Boop. Try again. All right, three saves on these noise marines. Get them off the table. Off the table. What's the damage? Two. Oh, okay. I'll CPU one. Does it matter? Still off the table. Still off the table. <laughs> <laughs> Get him out of here. Why would we? All right, I think we're good. Cool. Yeah. Mark? Great game. game. Yep. All right, so at the end of this one, I don't know what the scoreboard was. Yeah. Picking up some points at the end of this, though. Failing at the Eradicators may cost me. I don't know, though. I uh, have no idea on the points. I feel like you still got me here. Yeah, the primaries were pretty good for me for the bombs, helps out, and yeah. the secondaries. So, so let's let's go with Mark's score real quick. So at the end of this round, yep. I didn't kill anyone in combat. Nope. Did you? Oh, uh, I killed Goldman, but he's staying back up. I killed the Eradicator. Oh, the stupid... So never a point on the Emperor's Children. So one, one point on... Canvas of eclectic. Yeah, Stop that thing. one. Um, but you don't hold more objectives than me. Nope. You didn't character kill more than me. Nope. Um, that, okay, so that's that. So just one point on that. Yep. Two more on your banners. So your banners is a clean 10. Clean 10. And your assassinate sitting at a 9. Yep. Okay. Eight, add 8 to his primary. Yep. So I think you got 1, 4, a bunch of 8s, and then 8 at the end. Yeah. That's a pretty healthy a bunch primary. Of, yeah. Some 8s, some 4s, and then ever 8 okay. really helps out. Add 12 to my primary for primary, but I don't have any bombs up at the moment. Nope. Okay. Uh, my banners isn't changing. My oath of moment, I do have the center. I had it. Did I score did. oath last turn? Did I like actually say what was that last? It was a one. It was a one. Yeah, because you fell back. back. You okay. Fell back um, kill a character. Done. Got that. Fell back. Yep. Okay. So, so two. two points. Um, and then my um, what's my last one? Shock, Shock tactics, tactics three more, is a so twelve. A 12. Yep. All right. I think that's it. All right. The final Find score out. is sixty-six to fifty-seven for chaos. Oh! Only nine points. Great game, Mark. Ah. What matters is that the Demon Prince got absolutely he got gotten. He got slapped. Absolutely gotten. Yeah. Uh, the Chosen didn't actually make an attack against him at any point. No. I think I think if the Captain had uh, been a little more motivated to keep his job, <laughs> I think it would have been fine. No. Um, <laughs> he was just done. Yeah, that guy, I'm okay. so last edition. <laughs> yeah, that guy is out of here. Woof. Wasn't very impressive, and boy, did he not try to impress me. Uh, still a great game. What do you think about Cass here? I liked a lot, like seeing all the MSG. You see the like the very mm -hmm. different. Like Emperor Soldier has a very unique play style compared to other camp yeah. points. Very toolboxing all the situation stuff. Mm -hmm. Everything's very live here, a little bit there, a little bit. And like honestly, when you have like all these sergeants walking around power fist and a blast master, you just have bodies, mm -hmm. right? So that was really cool to see. Yeah, absolutely. I, I I liked how spread out the place was. Also, you did a lot of damage just adding up all yeah. this little crap. Yeah. Um, which I didn't enjoy seeing any of those noise marine units, but when they all shot, it's like, okay, this is actually starting to hurt. Right, and it's hard to dig out those blastmasters. Mm -hmm. Like the blastmasters really showed their value here. Yeah, the blastmasters were hyper annoying. I'm yeah, not gonna lie to you bringing six is real. <laughs> yeah, what do you got for Stry? I uh, just wanted to ask a post game question for Marcel Varel. He just wanted to ask if there was any hope of you guys playing Iron Warriors on stream soon. Um, I I think we're going to probably have a lot of chaos content coming up. Uh, I personally am a huge fan of Iron Warriors. They were uh, actually the second army that I started collecting way back in the day. Um, so perhaps. Uh, I have not really tried to write a Chaos Space Marine list for myself, but uh, we're probably going to play a lot with Chaos. I know uh, Jack is going to be playing a lot of games with Chaos as well. Nick is probably... No, actually, Nick's not a Chaos player. So Jack and Mark will probably be playing a lot of games with Chaos Space Marines. And uh, you know what? Maybe after they've uh, gotten their run in, maybe I'll do a little research on my own. I would love to play some Iron Warriors. So if neither of these guys are playing some Iron Warriors in the next month or two, I'll definitely get some on. Uh, Plus, Nick, Nick does play Death Guard. 
Uh, okay, so sure, sure, Charlie. Uh, however, if you want to make that happen, then at the end of every month, uh, our top donor can choose a matchup uh, for the next week, for the next month, or they can uh, get some cool custom metal Art of War dice, either one. But if you really want to see that matchup, our top donor every month can pick a matchup. So, you want me to play some Iron Warriors sooner Give rather away. than later, there's a way to do it. Buttons. Buttons. Press them buttons. buttons. Anything else for us, Charlie? Uh, not yet. Okay. Well, just talking about Multibrains, just real quick. Uh, honestly, I had a lot of I fun like with this. Uh, yeah. You know what? I was kind of memeing a little bit by like, how many elites can I cram into a patrol? But this actually wasn't bad. No. Um, I mean, I think I really just need to do... Uh, I mean, I just need a little, couple more games. The Goleman, honestly, at 300 points, it doesn't even feel terrible. Good. Yeah. Goleman's actually fine. I think, however, that I had more CP than I knew what to do with. Like, I really didn't need them. I think that like starting at 9 was super cool, but I honestly probably should just take Goleman in like, a Vanguard. And just completely cut out the tax units and get real elite choices. Yep. And then see what the list looks like from there. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, actually, it was, it was super fun to play Ultramarines again. And you know what? Goleman doesn't care. Could not be stopped. Noise Marines tickled a little bit, but he's like, all right, I'm not actually. I'm taking walking it. out with some wood. Yeah. He 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 took he took his pound of flesh. All right. Yeah. Great stuff. Well, good game. Thank you so much for your support, everyone. We appreciate it as always. If you're watching this and you haven't clicked that like. Um, subscribe button do it all look for the little bell click absolutely uh you know all your support on youtube is what allows us to make content like this so anything you know just even liking subscribing everything there is awesome as well you can get a ton of great content like this in the war room you can find that right here on our youtube channel or on our website theartofwar40k.com go check that out we've got a ton of high level stuff there as a matter of fact we just dumped a ton of videos in the war room we're reviewing the points changes and the nephilim changes for every single army in the game. So if you want to see our thoughts on a given faction, go to the War Room. It's in there. All right. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. We'll catch you next time. Bye-bye. Bye. There's so many rules in 40K, hundreds of events, and constant updates. Skip the learning curve of Warhammer and join the pros. Art of War is led by multiple world champions with decades of success. We teach clinics, stream games, and inspire you to succeed at your favorite hobby. Join our global community of gamers just like you. 